Hello. <coughs> Good evening. And welcome. Good evening, Fiend. How are you? Good to see you. Hello, a fantastic wit. Good to see you as well. Hope you're all both having a good day. Had a good day. It's day is over. <laughs> Day's over. Today is a good day. Whoa! Jesse K's in the house. What's up, bro? Good to see you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How's you? How's the fam? How's everybody? All right. Red Dead 2, man. It's going to be fun. I'm excited. We've got stuff to do. Lots of it. The game's nowhere near done, apparently. Um, I haven't even looked at it, but it says I'm like 60% complete. So, 66, 67%. So, that's going to be a few more streams, which I'm excited about. Chase, hi! What's up, buddy? How are you? And how is Maddie and everybody else in the world? The answer is yes. Yes, it needs a stampede string, which is the technical term for it. Okay, a stampede string for the hat. A stampede string. So, yeah, gotcha. I would wear this thing tonight, but my shoulders are kind of killing me from leaning forward to keep it off the chair from yesterday. So, we're going to hold off on that for right now. I prefer the chair over the hat. <laughs> But, uh, anyhow, you googled it. <laughs> hey. Uh, also, I've learned that Arthur's hat is what is known as a, uh, a gambler's hat. And they're really hard to find. Like, I don't know what it was modeled after. I know it was probably modeled after, or, I read it was modeled after an expensive hat, but, um, yeah. Yeah, another thing about that hat, it looks rather uncomfortable. It looks pretty uncomfortable. There's Jackbox on Wednesdays. That's why I leave this up. <laughs> so I don't forget to mention it. Uh, Jackbox on Wednesdays. Um, Yeah. So come on in right here on Wednesday nights. About 8.30 we'll do some Jackbox games and stuff. Um, But uh, yeah, his, his hat. It's got to be extremely uncomfortable. I don't see any vent holes in it. And I don't think it's made of felt. I think it's made of leather. So it's not going to breathe. So I think that is just going to be hot, hot, hot. Sit on a cushion so I'm taller. Or take a chainsaw to the back of the chair. <laughs> hey, Maddie, what's going on? How are y'all doing tonight? All of the members of the channel. I see you all. You're all there with your badges next to your names, ready to watch some Red Dead Redemption 2. Evil Cowboy is in the house. If Chase wants a sound effect, um... Then uh, we can go through, um, or you go through uh, Epidemic Sound and uh, choose one, or tell me a sound effect that uh, you are interested in. Um, it, it can't be anything from a movie or anything like that. It's got to be copyright free, or I have to have access to it on my library of sound effects, which is on Epidemic Sound and or Motion Array. Either one of those places. Uh, if you want to pick something out, let me know. I'll be more than happy to give you and Maddie and Dale. A sound effect and anybody else that wants one just please send me a dm on discord and i will make that happen or just drop it in channel discussion and uh channel discussion i could i could work too 
Yeah. Sounds like the Macarena. What the hell is going on with my music now? Anyway. Yeah, this song is like totally mislabeled. <laughs> this song is called The Western Shuffle. It is under Weird and Eccentric. And it's the fourth one when you type up Western. So, yeah. Everything around it's like slow, melodic, you know? Then there's that, the, the Western Shuffle. <laughs> Fun times. Anyway, we need game audio instead. But it does take a minute for this game to load, so let's play. Western my foot! I tell you what Western is, you gotta have yourself a guitar, a banjo, a train, a lady, and somebody's gonna cry in the rain. <laughs> oh my god. Welcome to the stream everybody. Smash like, subscribe if you haven't. Really do appreciate it. On the road to 1,500 subscribers, we getting there. 1450 is right around the corner. We just got about 10 to uh, to get there. You done open up that can of worms so we can go fishing. <laughs> All right, I'll shut up. <laughs> oh, horror! I just bought the Sonic movie and crawl from the google play store and you're ready to party with all of your movies on your tv that is awesome maddie is making cookies that is awesome cookies are awesome <clears throat> cookies are the shiz i had pizza rolls for dinner <laughs> uh, i had pizza rolls for dinner Oh, and I'm oh, in the and exercise, here we go! On the moon, and it's hot, air balloon! Mm. Hello, Cammy. <laughs> What's up, bro? Chocolate chip, butter toffee cookies with... What the... F Somebody needs to, to shoot that thing. Good lord. Well, we know that hunting is that direction. That thing tried to run me over. Y'all see them? Alright, you're getting chocolate pudding cookies? Oh, dude. Dude. What's up, Cammy and the messes? What the thwamp is yet? That, that thing just tried to, like, take out my posterior with its horniness on the top of its head. I brought it everybody did it, brother, huh? Where's my subtitles, yo? <laughs> Shopkeeper? Where are we? Saucy time! You PvP on this game. I have not gotten to that point yet. Uh, this is my, uh, my first playthrough. So, uh, not really, uh, not really up for a duel tonight. But welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a wonderful day. I don't know what I'm doing in this town. What, why have I come to this town here? Not sure. Ooh, Nutella cookies sound good. Must make now. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. So, saucy time. Are you into hot sauces or barbecue sauces? What variety of sauce are you into? It's a neat name, saucy time. Or are you just saucy? Are you saucy? I'm spicy. <laughs> Please tell me you're not a Packers fan. Oh, y'all are talking sport ball. Ah, what color do we root for? Hooray, sport. Good job. I know about Memphis Grizzlies and Tiger football, and, I mean, that's really the only thing that matters in life, so. <laughs> not, well, to some people, not to me. Yep, blue and silver all the way. If I had to pick sport ball, I choose Grizzlies basketball. All right, what I want to do 
We need to ride up here to Isabella and get this horsey horsey. We need to go get our horsey horsey in Isabella. So. Your mom is pissed over the Titans blowing it. I didn't even know the Titans were involved in anything of substantial importance. Um, research the Nutella cookies. Uh, now Wit wants some Nutella cookies. <laughs> I see how this works. <laughs> Maddie suggests Nutella cookies. Wit says, Sean, hey, bake me some Nutella <laughs> When we all get together, it'll be a grand old time baking cookies. <laughs> I, I, I will bake you some cookies with. I sure will. What is this? What's this way up here? <laughs> no, I belong to an anti-griefer crew called Griefer Hunters. You have forgotten me. We review hot sauces, but stuff, but currently on Studio 17. Ah, gotcha. Uh, I have forgotten, yes. I, I apologize. Um... Let's see, you... They lost to the Bengals. You suggested the Nutella... Oh, I thought that was Maddie. My bad. So sorry. Why doesn't this thing... Where do we go? With sprinkles chase. Jesus. Alright, yeah, okay. You suggested Maddie. Alright, I get it. Let's get back to this game. It was a very good game tonight, though. Alright, where are we going? We're gonna... Do we need to go to Isabella? Like, I'm, I'm intrigued by this little dot on the map. Like, that's got to be a little homestead. And that's got to be a little homestead. There's one way over here. We need to go, like, right here. That's where we need to go. We're going to go get a horse. We're going to go get a horse. Aha, we're going to go get a horse. What can I sell to Don't doubt it. Wow, they sell garment sets here. Amazing, the sauce. Smash that like button if you haven't already, because you guys are awesome. These people have shops! Wow, look at those shafts. Look at those shafts, man. The Rattler. I like the Rattler. Yeah, the Bronco Buster don't look too bad. Something about having this amount of hair covering the front of my pant leg is unnerving to me. It, it's like... Sasquatch man or something like tanned leather chaps is like where it's at like this look right here this is alert what yeah sure this is a decent look right here the bounty hunter yeah although that hat looks very similar to mine Desperado's nice, but there's no shaps. There's no shaps. Yeah, my Velcro gloves will get stuck in the fur. Ooh, the Night Wrangler. Ooh, Night Wrangler looks nice. The Mountain Man, look at that hat. That hat's crazy. The Ghost Bison. Alright, we don't need any of that stuff. Um, reinforced equipment. Ooh. Every one of my garments is a little different, because every pelt is a little different. You'll find them nowhere else. Oh, I've got to, like, complete challenges to get all this shit? Uh, might check one, two... Well, I don't want none of this crap. <laughs> MK! Hello and welcome. Good evening to you. Hope you're doing well, friend. Alright. Mm, so long, then. So long, Chaps friend. and boots made here, folks! 
Who is he yelling at? Like, for real, who is this man yelling at? Alright, so... This is... My horse. I'm wondering that myself. We're, we're gonna figure that out. This is my horse, Scarlet. She's pretty good. She's clean. Alright. See what Arthur's doing. I had a dream about Arthur Morgan last night, y'all. Actually, today, not last night, today. So, I dreamed that, so he's underweight and fair, so we still need to uh, get him some. Make sure autosave is disabled. You know, I'm going back and forth on that. I really am going back and forth on that. Like, this dude has got a horrible, like, everything here. I'm playing the game absolutely horribly. But I need to, uh... How do I fix this? Well, anyway, I had a dream about Arthur last night. I dreamt that I did nothing but camp and sleep and camp and sleep and camp and sleep. Um... And, like, I ate two bowls of stew back-to-back, -back, and I gained, like, 200 pounds, and I was, like, morbidly obese in the game, walking around, and my horse couldn't carry me, and it was the craziest dream in the world. Like, let's see. Um, what is temperature? All right, this is the weather. Well-being, tuberculosis, yeah. <clears throat> Alright, so you passed out uh, with the stream on and dreamed about pancakes. <laughs> Pancake! Auto oh, save. Jesus. Yeah. I actually have been thinking about that, though. I have two options here. The first option is I can <clears throat> um, turn autosave on, which it is now, and I can continue about my business like I have been. The second option is I can turn it off and actually remember to save because that's the good thing to do, the right thing to do. All right, we're going to cook, um, we're going to cook this. Pretty sure at some point in time we did start talking about pancakes. I, I like blueberry pancakes. I like blueberry pancakes. I know you're sick. But I'm going to keep cooking these things. We're going to stow it. Cook another one. Yeah, I had a great Beat Saber session on Twitch this morning. Played for a few hours over there. It was great. Lots of people tuned in. Had a raid from uh, Mr. Mr. Zemphis. Alright. Now let's sleep till morning. I think you need to do more for other video like what I sent you today.
I think I need to do more for other video. Okay, I, I've got to watch it. Um, so, uh, sure. <laughs> Sounds good. How you doing, Joe? And, uh, Thanks for the link. MK just got done with a long green screen, a green hell session. I don't know what green hell is. Interesting, though. What's all that? Yeah, I woke up in a different spot. What? I camped. Over here. And I woke up. Over here. Y'all remember that? Like me camping here. And then. All of a sudden I'm over here. That's odd. I need something with a lightsaber. LOL, lucky I got to use one in the video. I must have slept walked, apparently. There we go. Hey, look. It's a road sign. I have to get a picture of the road sign because See, the roads are getting tougher. We can actually play now. Gonna go for a ride on my horse, horse, horse. Idiot. All right, we're gonna go try to catch another horsey. Now I'm perfecting my pose. Yeah. Uh. Mic check one two. We're gonna go find ourselves a horsey. It's about time we get this horsey. Yeah. Yeah. You think that's where they got the term giddy up from? Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, giddy up. Giddy up. Yep, giddy up, giddy up. Man, look at this horsey go. This is a pleasant ride. Oh my goodness. Nope. Not, not today. Sorry. Uh, I wish I could, but... I'm on a mission. From... Somebody. I'm on a mission. For a horse. A horse is a horse, of course, of course, unless, of course, your horse is the uh, white Arabian that's up here at Lake Isabella. Yeah. And I might have to sell one of my other horses. 
Or I could just take it back to camp. Stable one of my other horses and take that horse back to camp. It's a good idea. Drive. Yep. Come on, Scarlet. Oh, rabbit. Rabbit. Gonna be a little bit of a drive, so. A little bit of a drive, a little bit of a ride. And look at that mountain. Look at that mountain, dude. Bear over there. There's a freaking bear. You go bear hunting? there bear I need a bear carcass it up. I was eating a fish It's a good bear pelt, though. And I have to uh, complete the game. So. Mominator, happy Saturday. Welcome. Hope you're doing good today. Can I take this fish? Yep. This fool just put a whole fish in his satchel. <laughs> this man put a fish in his satchel. <laughs> Let's break it down. Alright, succulent fish meat. Alright. Let's, uh... Hold on to that since meat doesn't seem to go bad here. All right. Get out of the pocket fish. It keeps you smelling extra fresh. <laughs> Take the bear and sell the meat or donate to camp. Uh, I need to make some room here. So, I'm, I need to figure out what to do with some of this stuff here like um I need to feed scarlets and stuff what else can I get rid of what else can I get rid of here I don't need horse cargo I need my cargo so I can get rid of some or so I can you know what I'm trying to say. Why can't I carry any more ingredients here? Oh, wait. No. Why can't I carry any more stuff? I can eat the bread chunk. That's good. Oh, 
Why can't I do anything with this? Show info. No. Ah. Uh, type in exclamation point corn and it will tell you. Um, I tried to uh, discard stuff. This is just the recent. So provisions, like, I have empty spots. I thought. There's nothing in here I need to get rid of. It takes the bear meat. Alright. Well, let's work on that later. <clears throat> I wish I could take the bear meat, but we got the pelt, which is for crafting, which is for the game's sake, so we can't feel bad about it. All right, and we got a fish. Yep. Hey, Chase got a boatload of corn. Oh yeah. All right, here's our sign again. Let's not run over the rabbits. We've already done enough killing for the time being. You know, this horse ran underneath a train yesterday. That was the silliest thing. Oh, you've got Red Dead? Is, is it cross-play? Like, can we, uh, after I get done, uh, after I get done with the story mode, can we, like, go on heists together and, like, stagecoach robberies and things? That would be really cool. No! Well, you need to build your PC. So much wildlife out here. <coughs> it's a great spot in the game to go hunting, apparently. Alright, let's get out of this. to be a bow and arrow. <coughs> yeah. It is beautiful. Like, just looking from here, I would think that was a real photo. If I didn't, like, get up on it, I would think that's a an actual photograph. Dauntless. <laughs> I've been lost in Red Dead. I do have Cyberpunk. What? This seems new. That did not seem like a familiar path at all. And there's Cyberpunk that I can play after this. It's okay. Subtitles. Oops.
Subtitles are supposed to be on right now. They're on. Some food? Is that what you want? Good job. All right. Yep. I think the horse is feeling better now. This does not look familiar. Oh, we're way far south. Alright, that's why this doesn't look familiar. Look at this atmosphere, though. My gosh. Wow, stunning. Yep. Come on, girl. Let's hope this horse is here. Boy. There, boy. We're still on the south side of the lake. Alright, so she should be right up here. Yep. Easy, whoa. Easy, boy, you're okay. All right. <clears throat> Let's go get our horse. I don't see any wolves. This is good. Hey there, beautiful. Hey there. Hey, beautiful. Come on, sweetheart. You're alright. Yeah. You're okay. Yeah. It's alright. It's gotta be all gentle. It's okay. Calm down. See? We're okay here. Yeah. Just fine. Yeah. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. You're all right. You're all right. Yeah. You're pretty horsey. Pretty horsey. Sure are. Yeah. Oh, good horse. Good horse. <clears throat> all right. Yeah. You're okay. You would never be backed into a corner this way, though. You would never be backed into a corner that way. I know you wouldn't be. No. Yeah? Oh, yeah? You want to talk to me? Talk to me a little bit? Mm-hmm. You're okay. Whoa! 
Oh, 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 oh. It's alright. Calm down. Calm down. Yeah. Good horse. There we are. Good horse. Good horsey. All right, let's go. Whoa! Whoa, 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 Don't, don't, don't. I lost it. I lost it. I lost it. It's gone. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. We're okay. Maybe not. Hold on. Don't go. Don't leave. All right, you're okay. You're all right, horse. You're okay. Don't, don't go. You're all right. Chill. Chill. Chill, horse. No, I don't need to lasso. I don't need to to break it by riding it. Okay, easy. All right, we're getting a second chance. It's giving us a second chance. Things are good. Yeah, let's try that again now. Come on, horsey. Here, horsey, horsey. She's enough. <coughs> You're all right, girl. It's okay. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Come on out of them trees. Last thing I want you to do is glitch into them trees. Is that Scarlet that helped you? I saw something wrangle it, kind of. Scarlet did uh, take off. I don't know if she was helpful or not, but she definitely did do something here. Hey. Hey. Oh. Oh. What an angle here. Oh, 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 no. Can't see. Whoa, 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 We got ourselves a horse. <laughs> we got ourselves a horse, y'all. <clears throat> now save it. Yep. So now what I'm going to do is... Alright, so it's my horse now, so I can get off, come over here, and I'm going to remove the saddle. Just let me get this off, boy. Then I'm going to put the saddle on this horse. And now, we're all going to ride back 
to... Maybe we don't want to ride back. Um, where's camp? Camp's way over here. I'm wanted dead or alive over here anyway. So this is where we live, I guess. Chocolate pudding cake... General, oh, dude, that sounds amazing. Well, y'all want to ride? Or fast travel? Uh, you do have to ride back for bonding time. So that's a very valid point. Don't mind doing that at all. So let's ride. And I also have additional horse cargo now, I'm pretty sure. So, that's awesome. Yeah. Alright, come on, Scarlet. We'll get Scarlet to uh, follow. The ditches are calling. Uh oh. What does that mean? Scarlet back there. Alright, Scarlet. I'm not going to put this Arabian in the stable. I'm going to put this Arabian in camp. This other Arabian's not happy either. <laughs> Where's this thing taking me? Across the river here. I can go legendary animal hunting, but I'd rather relieve myself of cargo. Yeah. Do that in post game. Or at least in between missions, I mean. Not right now. <laughs> Misfits and dreamers, hello! How are you? Oh, the ditches! Oh, I get you. I, I was like, what is he talking about? And then I was like, oh yeah, what reminded me that you're a tow truck driver. <laughs> oh no, this dude's gonna get hurt by a wolf again. That's his normal. No, no, not gonna take my chances with no wolf either. I'm, I'm sorry, buddy. You'll be there tomorrow. Dying to the same wolf just like you have been every, every Red Dead stream that I've done so far. Every Red Dead stream I've done so far, that same guy's been there. And that guy's been like, Help me! This wolf! Chase put up a picture of the Cookie Kate in the chat on the Discord. Oh, what you doing over there, Scarlet? So... We're currently riding Sue, right? We named this one Sue, the other one Scarlet. Move. Three inches of snow. Wow, goodness. It's still just cold around here. Don't run into that tree. I'm keep the game controller in my line of sight for the Bluetooth. Down through here now.
Good to be nighttime. What's going on here? Oh, it's only 3.30 in the afternoon. So we've done all this in the morning. Pretty much. That's not bad. Went out, caught a horse, tamed it. Riding it back to camp all in a morning. Not bad at all. We'll be in Valentine by evening. Maddie's toffee and dark chocolate cookie dough is in there now too. Ooh. So yep. good. get out of our winter clothing now we should probably eat something too this is gonna sound good and I'll probably need to uh, do something for the horse too Horse of sugar cube. <clears throat> Double fudge ice cream. Yum. Now come on. Now come on. Oh. Wrong with you. Come on. place in here is just so pretty. He's running along this little stream here, man. This river is so awesome. You crazy? What are you talking about? I'm just ca carrying a horse with me. I mean. Oh yeah, it's this dude that's doing the crazy stuff in the lake. Yep, yeah. he's a weird one. Hey. What's wrong? What was your problem? You forget how to walk? <gasps> yep. Hello, Hong, Hong, something. Hello, welcome to the stream. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Is that a family of skunkages over there? Kind of looked like it. Excuse you? These people are rather rude in Valentine. There's a theater over there? Oh my. Alright, let's hold up here. Let's dismount and let's take care of some horse care products. Or do some horse caring here. Alright, that horse is gonna take a dump. Very nice. Move your ass, sir. Um. Hey there. Moment, please. Yeah. 
That was rather rude. Hey, where, come here. Horse? Horse. What, where is my horse going? What did that stagecoach driver do to you? What did that idiot do to you? You're okay, girl. Easy, girl. You're okay. Oh, thank you for the subscription. Inversa? I need to go track that guy down and shoot him. Alright. Oh, do I not have any horse food? Ooh, she is dirty. You have to brush both sides of your horse? Mm -hmm. there, there, girl. Wow. I didn't know you had to brush both sides of your horse. I knew which one it was, man. That does not sound good. Alright, horse needs food, yo. I need to buy this, this horse some food. out of here I'll buy them some food when we get somewhere probably need to go buy them some food now actually let's go buy the horses some food we'll spend the night in camp that stage driver yet but man if I see him again oh, I can get the horse care package there in Valentine gold cores yep I can do all that yep I should do all that too while I'm here it's still only 645 so I mean I like whatever they're building here. Um, this way. Come on. Who's this then? Just me and my two Arabians. <laughs> Just me and my two Arabian horses. No big deal. There's a trapper over here. Wait, that's not a trapper. You ain't the first tried and failed to get rid of me. Suggest we call it quits. That suit you? What is wrong with this guy? Wow. What did he just say? Getting ambushed and robbed with the nicer horses. Oh, wow. Howdy. What can I buy from this guy? A prime beef joint? What? The prime beef joint. Wow. Yeah. 
Let's go right in town. My two Arabians. Hey, mister. Enough of this horse shit. Well, um... If a horse is your primary means of transportation, and you're tired of horse shit, then maybe, just maybe, church to atone for what you did to me don't mess with me again don't dawdle get what you need and go all right i will i need no horse supplies from you. Here's the catalog. i need horse care Um, where do I buy horse food? Worms, crickets, cover scent, herbivore bait, rifles. I ain't gonna stay patient forever. Get down to business. Uh, might check one too. The sable sells horse food. There's some oat cakes. Those are good. The chocolate bars were good. I got things to tend to, so get on with it. Sir, you're a a jackass. You are rude. to the stable. Take this girl in. Get her worked on here. Welcome to you and your horse. Afraid I ain't got any spare stalls for you. Uh, you uh, you come down with something there, partner? Some bad flu going around. Nah, it's just it's nice. a cough. Well, unfortunately, you ain't a horse, so I can't help you with that. But what can I help you with? Uh, horse care package. Oh, the horse will really like this. We need to rename the horse. This is going to be Sue. Oh, that's a good match. All right, so there's Morgan. Morgan's a good horse. Uh, Tennessee Walker. There's Bobby. I never named. All right, I need to sell. I need to sell this Tennessee Walker, I think. I can always get another one. Alright, so what do they have for sale these days anyway? <clears throat> I know a lot of my breeders personally. Brown That's horses that are in stock. Can we get a horse named Mac Attack? <laughs> Maybe. Uh, this is a Hungarian okay, half. Info is right stick. All right. All right, let's go back. You named me a horse. Um, manage owned horses. 
So I need to get up out of here. And then I need to bring my other Arabian in. Um, I would like to hitch my horse to something. Stay here for now, girl. Dutch warm blood is pretty good when starting chapter two. Oh, that's cool. All right, let's get on you. Get her all. We have here? That's a fine steed. Thank you. Got some stable space for rent if you're interested. Yep. Actually, no, I'm not. All right. Well, uh, Scarlet's in here. I need to go back, and I need to go to Tack and Services, Manage, Scarlet, Saddle Up. Okay, let's go switch them. And now we will go back, and we'll go to Tack and Services, Services, Horse Care Package. Maybe keep the horses happy, right? All right. I sold one of my horses. I sold just a stock horse that I, was low level that I had. All right, horse care package is good. Renamed. All right. We're good. Come back I'm always happy to stable that horse. All right, so my white Arabian is in there now. We're over here now. Very good. Um, I need to maintain some of these things here. They're dirty. All right. Oh, that is dirty too. Way dirty. forget to save. Thank you. All right. 23, 24. Good. All right. That one's good. All right, uh, we have horse provisions, so we probably need to feed our horse. Oh, wait, we've already done all that. The horse is fine. Let's go to... He's gonna fast travel over there. I'm not gonna ride that Arabian right now. Yeah. He's gonna fast travel. See, where is Wilderness? Wilderness is this way. Ooh, I just pick up a nice little spot right here. That's literally right outside of town. Whoops. 
Hold on, let me go slightly further out of town. Camp. What are you doing, Ducky? We select all the squares with 220 ohm resistors. Okay. Weird. Fast travel. What was the name of our camp? I've forgotten. We've moved so many times. Beaver Hollow. Send me a picture of some kind of a CAPFA that's like select the squares that have all of the images that it describes and it was a picture of a circuit board with a bunch of resistors on it and you have to um, pick out the 220 ohm resistors and none of the others. I think it's a geek joke. Should we go and see Strauss, you think? I think I'm going to go see Strauss, just if nothing else, to get the, uh, whatever, uh, settled here. And have more missions available to me. Mr. Morgan. <laughs> Herr Strauss. How are you? About... About how I look. Okay. <sighs> are you, um... Are you perhaps available for some work? Debtors? Yes. I guess. Your commitment to your duties is admirable. <clears throat> you know, Mr. Morgan, you are... Well, I'm sorry for you. Huh? No, never mind. I didn't... Look, Strauss. You take care. Hmm. I ain't dead yet. No, of course not. That's what I was saying. I, uh, I... A debtor, Strauss. Who owes you money? Well, hmm. uh, there's a deserter from Fort Wallace. Oh, great. Get to him first. They're looking for him out on the road near Three Sisters. Man's name is J. John Weathers. J. John Weathers. Then there's a miner over in Annisburg. He's called... Well, he's called Arthur. Like you. Huh. <laughs> Arthur Londonderry. Family man, desperate, you know the type. Couldn't one of the boys do this? I tried. They lacked your... Persuasiveness? Vigor. 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 Huh? Huh. All right. Uh, take care, uh, uh, Mr. Morgan. All right. <sighs> Oh boy. Oh, uh, I don't have to go to Fort Wallace. I just have to go here. Alright, let's go see Johnny Boy. Let's go see Johnny Boy. What time is it anyway? It says I'm wanted dead or alive. That's great. Give me a time of day. It's AM. Do I plan to grow a big Twitch audience one day? Um, I ha I tried to pay the bounty and it wouldn't let me. Uh, not for the dead or alive one. 
Um, I would like to have a larger following on Twitch one day. I certainly would. Um, it's, uh... That beast will shout all over everything. That is something that I would... <clears throat> like to... Come here! Hey! Why is there a trail there if you won't let me walk on it? See? Yeah, I would love to, um... I would love to try to grow my audience on Twitch. Let's go this way if you're going to be silly about it. That's not going to work. Is there any way down this ridge? thing with Twitch they take um 50% of your revenue and won't let you stream on YouTube. They do quit they do take uh they do take fifty percent. Um they do let me stream on YouTube just not at the same time as I stream on Twitch. So come on horse. Alright. You can't walk that way. We'll go this way. You be able to traverse this terrain? No? I like Twitch. Twitch has a lot more integrations than YouTube does. They're not as stingy with their API. There's a lot more interactive things that the viewers can do with the streamer. That, uh, I know overall, I think it's a, uh, more polished platform for the things that I would like to accomplish as a live streamer. But I also prefer YouTube because, I mean, it's, it's more widely known, I guess, than Twitch. It's not, um, I don't know how to say it really. It's not, uh, it doesn't have just the the stigma of being just for gamers. Like I get I get that a lot if I ask people, you know, if they've ever heard about uh, Twitch and all that and they say, Yeah, it's that video game streaming thing. Like, yeah, it is, but you don't have to stream video games on there. They have a just chatting section, they have slot section that many of y'all are familiar with. I'm familiar with it a little bit myself. Carson does. There's, uh, there's plenty to do on Twitch. You can be as creative as you want to, but the reach is just not there. Twitch doesn't have a promotion system like uh, YouTube does. The algorithm doesn't work quite right. Over there, it's like the more popular you are, the more popular you are, seemingly the... Uh, the more your channel gets pushed, which, I mean, it goes back to the whole, if you see a stream that's got 300 viewers, do you want to go to that stream, or do you want to go to the stream that has one viewer that you've never heard of them before? Um, a lot of the times, I like to watch the smaller streamers that I've never heard of before, never seen, or anything like that, because it's going to take that that support and that that viewership just to promote them on the platform because Twitch isn't going to work for you that way. Uh, like YouTube is doing a lot of work for me on these Red Dead videos right now. It's promoting the um, 
is promoting the heck out of these videos. Well, it was. I don't know if it still is. So yesterday's uh, stream didn't show the same performance as the others on the back end. But, I mean, YouTube latched onto this Red Dead thing, and they've been throwing views. Like, throwing, not views, but throwing suggestions for views my way. And uh, people have been clicking on the thumbnails, which is pretty awesome. Uh, trust me, BGP, you're going to make a huge break someday soon. Huge spike on YouTube is near. I hope so. I would like to be able to <clears throat> call this a career. I would like that very much. So we're going to take our carbine repeater, and we're going to take our... Double barrel, no, the semi-auto shotgun. Um, I, I liked in YouTube usually easier to find more mature community members before I deleted my channel. Average was 30 to 60 year old. Okay. Um, mostly to Google, thanks mostly to Google integration and ease of use, whereas Amazon doesn't throw out Twitch hardly at all, despite, yeah, um, despite the ownership of, Am by Amazon. Yeah, it's always been kind of my opinion that broadcasting on YouTube was more like, I mean, it's video production, and broadcasting on Twitch is like, I don't know, it's like techie. Like, broadcasters on Twitch either have a team of people behind them or a group of people that help them to set up their gear and then they just hit a button and go. Just like they're the talent and... Just like they're the talent and somebody else is producing the show. I mean, like Good Mythical Morning. Those guys, and they're not on Twitch that I know of, but, you know, they're YouTube videos. You know, they just go into the studio, they have a production facility, they sit down, they do their thing, they get up, they leave. Um, and, you know, the Twitch streamers, you know, and people like myself, we spend hours upon hours just sitting down with OBS. The MK knows this. Cowboy knows You all know this. But we all sit down for hours and working on emotes and uh, graphic design and, you know, just getting our OBS set up properly. It can be a real tedious, long, drawn-out process. Um, yeah, I mean, if you find your niche over there, it's okay. Um, but, you know, finding that niche, just like anything else, it's hard. Um, all right, let's start here. What do we got? I believe you owe me some money. Yeah, you, people do come to YouTube for tutorials quite a lot. It's like 70% of people come to YouTube videos looking for a how-to. It's insane. And reviews, product reviews. J. John Weathers. They call me Snow Goose now. Whatever they call you. You borrowed money off of Leopold Strauss. The bills come due. This ain't the best time, sir. This ain't the best time for <laughs> anyone. Mr. Strauss knew it was a long-term proposition. The debt is due. Okay. I got supplies meant to last through the winter. You can take home. Just, is there any way you can help me? I stay out here, there won't be anyone to pay you. I ain't here to help. I'm here to collect. We're all, all of us up against it. Look, there's men after me. <laughs> They're killers. I ain't a deserter, just an objector. It ain't right. If there was another way than running, I need your help. Shut up. Please. I... Up here, it's him. Oh, it's great. Too late. Warm up, we shoot on sight. I clear off, sir. Ah, shit. Well, seeing as I'm here, I'll, I'll do what I can for you. Where is he?
Come on. All right. Hey, Brian, what's up? Welcome. I have a document. I really want you to work on your temper, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Well, at least my horse isn't dead. Good girl. Save something. Really now? Look, you can take the silver locket for the debt. Reclaim the debt? Yes. I need to. Go. Get her somewhere safe. Go on. Thank you, fella. I don't know where we can go, but I'll try. Pray for us. We're past praying. Well, that was good. I don't reckon there's anything on this wagon worth looking at. Even, well, even when the man's dying, he's still taking his money. That was my job, unfortunately. Let's save our game. That one's done. Where are we going next? There's a random stranger over there. We are wanted dead or alive in Ainsburg. How are we going to do this? We have to get into town without getting seen. That's crazy. So we need to go back to camp. Need to go back to Beaver Hollow. Hey, good night, Bob. Have a good one. It was good seeing you again. Hope you're having a great night. Wear a mask. That's a good idea. Probably a change of clothes. It's fast travel. Be 
Beaver Creek or whatever it's called. Beaver Holler. Beaver Holler! So, I'm going to do something a little bit unique here. Well, um, Hitch the horse. Let's see if we have any food ready. Morning. You okay? What is happening to us? Just Stu is currently being prepared. We're going to go over here and shave and change outfits. Go to our clothing locker here. Let's change our coat to our... This one here, no coat. Vests. Let's do the Legion vest. Oh. Pants. Need some town pants. And I need to change my hat. Uh, I need my clothing. Why? Beaver Valley hat. Let's go. Save this outfit. Okay, now we'll go back. Now we go up to outfits. Winter gunslinger is on my horse. So let's um remove from horse here and then let's go to winter gunslinger and put that on our horse all right let's go now we're gonna go over here and shave <sighs> holy cow Alright, we're going to shave, but we're going to keep our hair. We're going to keep our hair. Come on! What's wrong? Hello? Hello? What's wrong with my controller? The light was still on. Pomade hair. Alright, now let's go over here to our horse. 
What time is it? Twelve oh five, so the stew should be ready now. I don't want coffee. I want the... I want the bowl. Of stew. Pick up bowl. Are you dense? What's going on? I don't want to pour coffee. Uh, oh, there's no stew pot. It said check back afternoon. Well, the noon is here. Anyway. Remove bear pelt. Can I like store this someplace? Donate it. Here. Without good meat is no stew at all, Mr. Morgan. It's gonna be sold though. Let's sell it to that guy. I'll just come back later. Can I just go and put this at my tent, maybe? If I just drop it by my tent, maybe it'll still stay here. We can't support a drunk miss. Oh, go scratch your sores, you old bag. Excuse me, you heard. I'm just gonna drop it right here. Drunk or sober, you watch your mouth. It will always be left in a convenient location. Alright, so the convenient location is right over here by the campfire, right next to my tent. Alright. And it's on the map even, that's great. That's great, okay. Hello. Hello. I'll eat a biscuit. What time is it? Noon still somewhere around there. So we have shaved. We've gotten a new horse. <clears throat> I felt like it was my security blanket too, in a way. Let's go check out this Arthur London Dairy feller. Hopefully. Everything will be alright. Alright, headed east. Let's go. Don't have time right now. Being attacked by a dog. -a do I not like going into this territory? Maybe it's because I feel like something bad might happen. You don't miss the excitement again. I hope not to. Uh, 
How do I get down there? Alright, I'm gonna go around this way. Come down this way. For an Arthur Londonderry, I was told he works here. Londonderry? Oh, you'll want to speak to the foreman. He's down in the pit. Okay. He's down in the pit. Let's go to the pit. Wait a minute. Do I have to go back? in there I guess if he's in the pit then maybe I should just go in here the best way to get here proceed with caution all right maybe I can go to the map and put a waypoint there Feller, but you're too late. Arthur's dead. <laughs> the man's dead. What's wrong with you? Oh boy, you can't exactly beat it out of him now, can you? <laughs> you might get something off his widow just across from Butcher's Creek, but I'd hurry. You ain't gonna be the only one a knocking. <laughs> you ought to be ashamed of yourself. Hey. I ain't the godforsaken money lender. Well. I guess I need to get up out of here. <clears throat> get out of here. I am trying to do that. I forgot how I came in, as usual. Working on it. On your way now. On your way now. Right. Idiots. <sighs> now 
Now this girl's way down here. What are we gonna do here? I'm wanted in this territory. But I just need to get on the road. Alright, that's the train station right there. So if I were to come over here... And go to this train station. It's the waiting room. I told you not to go out bear hunting. You never no good at your I'm great hunter. Caught on the wares by the train. Hey, partner. Funny, you're trapped. Holy spring hairs, ain't you? How they got we Visible to the eye. You didn't remember where you put it? I was focusing on the bear, goddammit. Howdy. Nice to see you. I'm pay my bounty. Good on you. Get a fresh start. I can't pay it. There is nothing to pay. Y'all right there, sir? Not yes. really. Why? Ah, been some grip going around here, and I just thought. Uh... I don't like that dude running around with a. A rifle like that. Okay, Alright, if I'm wanted in this territory, then I need to go... Yeah, just straight down here, it's fine. Alright. I'm still wanted in the territory. So we're going to alter our path a little bit if we see anybody. Yeah. Alright, away from the railroad tracks is good. If we see anybody, we need to get up off the road though. I need to brush my horse too. Why can't I brush my horse? It says that she needed brushing, but it wouldn't let me brush. What in the heck? Oh, there's people over there. So we got to go up into the mountains. Stay sharp. Christ, I got it, all right? Mm. They're actively hunting for me. For it. <clears throat> it's just we lent Arthur some money, you see, and so it was you. You son of a bitch. What do you want now? You want my boy's shoes? You want the food out of our bellies? What little there is? You want me to lie down for you? No, no. Arthur gave everything to pay your bills. Everything. And now there's some fellas coming to take the house. There ain't nothing left, mister. Mm. It will be nice. Uh, I just wanted to say the debt's canceled and to you know, take this. 
It won't bring your husband back, I know. You need money and I don't. Well, you're a good man. I just wish you'd done it before he worked himself into the grave. All right, we've done our Robin Hood mission. Yay. But you know, <coughs> maybe you and your friend that lent him the money could do things differently. Like, not threaten a man. Excuse me. I'm sorry, ma'am. I really am. Oh, it was only $55? It was only 55 bucks? Really? Wow. All right, let's go. Okay, boy. Let's go. Go back up here to where Strauss is. Yeah. Stay away from the main road, though. I am going to put a marker up there, though. Enough. We're just gonna ride through the woods. Wait, we need to ride the other way through. Just get on the path. Whatever. Set up camp and fast travel. That's an idea. You ain't welcoming these parts. Shoot. And the Murphys remember what you did to them. Ah! Ah! Hey, you're gonna meet the maker. Where's my horse? Uh, where's my horse? Tear down camp and get further out. Just ride straight through the woods here. Get out in the middle of the woods. Far, far and away from that camp over there. the best way to do this. 
go back over in here someplace. Yeah. Try this again. Kind of secluded a little bit over here, over the ridge. Supposed to hitch you. Anyway, oh, uh, where's Strauss out? I think he's gonna be mad. you get on, Mr. Morgan? Just then. Hmm. Just... Get up. What? Get up! What? What is wrong? Nothing's wrong. Nothing at all. What are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Get your bag. Is this it? I don't understand. I ain't gonna kill you. Though I probably should. You disgust me. And you shame us. If we could be shamed any more than we already are, that should do. Go! I don't understand you. What are you doing? Go and get a job! You know, they, they say the sick delude themselves. I was your friend. You and me, we ain't decent. But those folk, they was. Now here. Take that. Take that and get lost. All right. I'm leaving. <laughs> well, extreme personality. Woohoo. Paradise. Yes, it is. How are you feeling about Molly? I'm feeling she got exactly what she deserved. That's what I figured. All right, do we have any food that's prepared? Okay, Javier. Hola. Another night in paradise. Hey there. Hey y'all. All right. Are you all right? Strauss is gone. It was time. He was a mean, mean man. Don't you give me that look. So just like that, Strauss is gone. GG on Where's Arthur, right? This is done, Abigail. All right, at our stew, let's pour ourselves some coffee. Regaining some stamina or dead eye, looks like. OK. 
Okay. So let's. You know, I can go get more coffee, actually. Good evening to you, Mr. Morgan. Good evening. Reverend, I think you did the right thing with Herr Strauss. It was time. Thank you. I'm just gonna keep drinking coffee, fill up all this stamina stuff here, or dead eye stuff. Alright. Now, can I get some coffee poured and take it with me? That would be cool. That'd be really neat. Oh, no, it won't let us take it with us. Let's just sleep. I wish there was a ledger here so that I could contribute to the camp. You okay, friend? Never better. Dutch. You're breaking his heart. You know that. Did he tell you to say this to me, friend? No. <laughs> but I know. Dutch, and that fool at his ear, they're gonna kill every last one of us. I see that now. Hmm. I don't know what Dutch is gonna think about this. I don't exactly want to find out right now. Let's sleep until the morning. I'll be right back. I'll go relieve one of the guards. All right, we have slept. Morning. Now let's leave. Arthur. Thank you. Thank you so much. Well, we ain't done yet, Abigail. Dutch seems to have lost his mind. I know. Just be careful. I don't have to be careful. I, I have you as a friend. Yeah, me as a friend. All right, let's get this on. How on earth do I get in here to see Edith Downs? Ugh. Oh, this is going to be hard. I got to go see Micah and Edith. I've got to do it without get being seen. So, hmm. Save game. Yep. Right. 
says that my horse needs brushing. So I can't I brush my horse. There we go. I can feed it first, that's fine. It didn't need to be fed. Alright, now let's go brush the other side. Alright, now let's get up on the horse. And go. All right, what? All right, is this just a straight shot over there? Doesn't look like there's any towns or anything. Why is it making me go all the way down there? I need to be going to like here somewhere. That map is taking me in a weird place. Just roll with it for now. Actually. I'm not dealing with you right now, dude. Okay. Chill. Calm. Calm down. Go easy, boy. All right, let's skin the wolf. Just hold on there, boy. Or wolf pelt. Yeah. <clears throat> I scared every little noise. Yeah. So what's up with this feller? I guess he's dead. Okay. Well, a good rabbit pelt. All right, boy. Oh, not horrible. He died to death. <laughs> yeah. Steep. Way too steep. I don't like taking this road, but... We kind of got to do what we kind of got to do here. Oh. Oh man, that's a town, yo. Oh man. Oh. How far away are we?
Too many people. Too many people around here. Wide open spaces over here, geez. issue horse horse shut up it's all right boy it's your problem horse want a peppermint jeez rude Temperamental? How in the world am I going to do this? I need to get off of my horse. Let's get. He needs to follow me. We're just going to walk in here and see what happens. don't look like lawmen or anything so maybe we're okay there's my horse Let's see if I can get to Edith and progress the story without getting spotted people around here looking at me, you know. I guess might as well go and confront one of them that looks like a mine worker. So far nobody's saying anything to me. Hello there. You were why are you pushing me off, man? leave I, I don't know I said I had the money she said your money weren't moral she said it'd be better to die than to take it <laughs> maybe she's right I don't know I don't know anything about morals. she's still heading out working you know I'm sorry son. sorry about all of this she ain't been back for a few hours 
She left with some fellow down the railway tracks. I did not like the look of him. Which way, you say? Uh, that way. Around the woods, towards, uh, Willard's Rest. I'll see what I can do. Great. I'm gonna buy all these newspapers. Have fun reading. I will, thank you. Make sure you come back tomorrow. No one, come on. Read all about it. How far away is this? I need my horse. Alright. Are you at horse? There you are. Fine, I guess. All right, let's get. Yep. I'll be down this way. No. Unknown animal. Stop tracking. I found people. I found Edith. All right. Very good. Hey, welcome back. That's enough now, partner. You're starting to scare me, let alone the poor woman. Clear off. Who are you? Someone who don't want to hear no more of your nasty mouth. Push me. I'll put a bullet in you. I, I presume Archie sent you? I said clear off before I deal with you. See you again, dearie. Listen. Listen to me. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. You sound like my husband. I know. Listen, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for what happened. I was uh, a fool. And I'm suffering for my foolishness. But don't go and get yourself killed because of your pride. You have a son. Mrs. Downs. I'm just so ashamed. <sighs> ashamed? <laughs> of what? <clears throat> you loved him. <laughs> you did everything for him. <laughs> Let's get you home. Good. All right, so now we have to go back to Ainsbury. So, how 
was the best way to do this. Just ride straight into town. Like we just did. Pretty much, apparently. So, I'm going to set a waypoint for, like, here. The Mobinator! You came back. Welcome back, Mobinator. I'm sorry I had to come to this. Stop saying sorry. <clears throat> sorry won't bring Thomas back. I know. <laughs> so you're sick now, too? And you think that affords you the opportunity for penance for cutting his time short? No. I ain't looking for that. Okay, then. So just forget about me and the guilt you're carrying, because no good can come of that for either of us. And all you can do now is decide the man you want to be for the time you have left. Help someone who can still be helped. Why help yourself? I suppose you're right. Oh, hang yourself for all I care. You're right to dislike me. I ain't looking for that to change. I reckon nobody in here really cares about me. So we're just gonna go on in. Okay, all that's blocked off. All right, we can't go this way. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's the matter with you? Sorry. Archie should be waiting for us just up ahead. someplace else start over here take this I don't need it no more I don't want your money yeah I know you don't want it I don't you sure as shit need it take it no I ain't looking for forgiveness it ain't about that but don't forgive me just take the money and get out of here please I know I ruined your life I suffer for it every day but don't let yourself get killed for, for pride I seen it kill too many folk don't say anything. Don't thank me. Just take the money and pack your bags. That's all I gotta say. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. I said don't thank me. Get out of here. Please. Okay. Okay, boy. So now we can progress the mission yay story how far away am i i am currently 57 percent in it looks like so the progress i am 66 percent of the story uh <clears throat> so yeah So now, what do we have? We gotta see Micah. This is the end, my only friend. The end. Okay. I hope this isn't the end of the game. 87%? Right on. Is this your first playthrough, Mobinator? There's a sheriff's office right there. Why do I want to go over there if I'm wanted dead or alive? Like, how does that even work? Was you followed? No, oh, you played was it once? you followed? I said no! <laughs> okay. <laughs> what is your problem? 
What is your problem, partner? You don't, uh, you don't look so good. What is wrong with you? Nothing wrong with me. I'm fit as a fiddle. And not inside you, ain't. I'm Dutch. just a realist, friend. Micah reckons there's a rat. Oh, does he? On what evidence? He's only back a minute. Pinkerton show up. <laughs> We've been on the run since you two fools went crazy in Blackwater. We barely escaped with our lives in San Denis. Now we got a rat. Well, Molly clearly talked, but who else? Maybe we pushed things too hard. Oh, Maybe time for folks like us has passed. We don't need a rat. We got sloppier than the town drunk. And they oh, know who the we are, and where we are, and what we're doing. The way I see it, the best thing we can do is let the week go. Move on, get our money, and start over. That ain't happening. Well, something's gotta happen. And fast. Otherwise, Cornwall, them Pinkertons, they've got us panned in here. <laughs> and ain't none of them stopping. Well, Cornwall's why we're here. Shall we, Dutch? Yeah, it's time to go. Let's head to the river. Oh, leave Cornwall alone. He ain't. We need money. But revenge? Now? Of course it's for money. Come on, Arthur. This better not be no stupid revenge mission, Dutch. It ain't worth it. Don't be ridiculous. Oh, Arthur. It's just a simple social call. <laughs> <laughs> mm hmm. A simple social call. I don't so like this. What are we gonna say to him that needs to be said? He has been hunting us since Valentine. He is the reason that Hosea got killed. His sugar business is destroying the people of Guarma. This town, Arthur, is his town. He bought it just to destroy <laughs> these folks. His sugar, his oil, his law. These are wrongs that you can't write, Dutch. We wanted men. Hmm. So why did you go for John against my wishes? I didn't want him hanged. Neither did I. Yeah. We're gonna cut a deal, Arthur. What are you talking about? We want out, and Cornwall wants us to stop robbing him, and we all know his money is what's keeping the Pinkertons on our tail. He's America, Arthur. And I want out. And he... He won't let us go. This ain't making a lot of sense, Dutch. It will, son. It will. A deal, some noise, and then we're gone. Cornwall's boat is due in soon. Let's get down here behind these crates. Hide behind the crate there, buddy. Okay. Where are you going? What are you doing? Get back! I'm right here. I hid behind the crate, fool. Arthur, you're going to blow our cover. There. I'm behind crates. Maybe I have to be behind this crate? Yeah, I had to be behind that crate. <clears throat> you for your hospitality, Mr. Cornwall. This was a business meeting, Mr. Milton. We are not friends. I have spent a considerable fortune with your agency and still nothing. 
This Cover and concealment. And laughs at me. He's being I concealed right now, not covered. I paid for the best. We are very close, Mr. Cornwall. I know you've heard this before. Can't, sir. Send a telegram to Goldberg in New York. Tell him I won't borrow it more than 3.2%. Sorry, no, I have heard it before. And get that army man to pay his portage charge. Yes, sir. We are doing all we can within the confines of the law. The law? I think we both know what you can do with your law. Find me Dutch Vanderland. Bring him here and leave the laws to them as need them. Good day, sir. Oh. Come along, Mr. Ross. We have work to do. Mr. Didsbury. Mr. Cornwall. Now listen up, Didsbury. What's all this about strikes? I bought into this mine because of mismanagement. And I intend to make it a success no matter what the cost. It's the wages. Folk feel Folk that you... feel? Business doesn't give two figs about feelings, sir. Not two figs. And it's a nonsense that will bring a plague on both our houses, sir. Perhaps there is a plague on your house already, Mr. Cornwall. What mm -mm. do you want, sir? I'm not quite sure just yet. Your impudence will be your undoing, sir. I'm undone already. Even my best friend here, he thinks I'm crazy. And like this poor fellow you are talking to, my feelings are hurt. You robbed me, sir. And you robbed him. Funny world. You show a criminal's grasp of sophistry, sir. I did no such thing. You kill. I kill. You rob. I rob. Only difference I can see is I choose whom I kill and rob and you destroy everything in your path. I've heard just about enough. I'll tell you what. You give me this ship, $10,000, and safe passage out of here, I'll mm -hmm. leave you <laughs> I'll do no such thing. <laughs> you sure? Good. I prefer it this way. Oops. Noise, Arthur! No boys! Alright, through the face. Alright. What the hell have you done, Dutch? Get that asshole! Um cover transition. Go! Come on, fools. I found something interesting. Come on, we gotta move. Come on, this way, up the stairs. I'm trying to get to the stairs, you fool. Arthur, come on. I'm coming, fool. Where are you? Where are you?
Alright, I'm running out of ammo. I only have 10 cartridges now. I can't go that way. Alright. Yo! We tried talking it out. Boys, lost your minds. Oh, I felt a lot of guilt in this life, Arthur. I've killed too often and poorly, but not this time, son. Come on! <laughs> All right, let's head for the hills, boys. They're trying to block us off. Go right! Going, boys. On the left, roll the bastard. I don't see him. Got him. They're trying to cut us off again. Go left. Shoot, man. Go, go, fool. Go, go, horse. Go, 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 horse. Hey. Yeah, I just killed Cornwall. Interesting social call. No, oh, don't play dumb and superior at the same time, Morgan. We all knew sooner or later Cornwall had to go. Let me see them papers. It's more attention we don't need. Feels like the whole world's closing in on us. Dutch, it won't be long before they find where we're hiding out now. Especially as we ain't exactly hiding out. We just need a distraction. Buy us some time. It looks like Mr. Cornwall's company has signed a railroad contract with the Army. And they're also moving dynamite down from, well, the Annisburg mines to San Denis to resell. And there's bonds at his oil factory. <clears throat> Maybe there's a way to get them off our back and get the money that we need. Micah, you look into this dynamite. Take Bill, I guess, Arthur. You go too. We are gonna need a lot of it. And Mike, we need to talk. Figure out some things. Of course, boss. Figure out what? The plan. Getting out of here. Nothing's changed. It hasn't, huh? There's an old house west of Van Horn. Meet me there when you can, Black Lung. Let's split up. We'll meet up back at camp. Yeah. <clears throat> this is crazy. I agree. Kind of crazy. My horse is still in range. Heck yeah. <clears throat> Let's go, boy. Okay. Let's save. Is the plan good? Anybody know? I have no idea myself. Uh, let's overwrite that. Yeah. All right, fifty-eight percent. We'll check the game map. All 
right. So it still has us doing things. <sighs> In this town. Where we're wanted. But we're really wanted down here. So we can go see Micah. What's up with Micah? Uh, index. This does not tell me what I'm supposed to do. Hmm. This Dutch is planet. Yeah, exactly. So it has like nothing. We can go see Micah and Reverend Swanson. Reverend Swanson is up here. Roanoke Ridge. And then... Micah's down here. So I guess we go see... Them. Really need to get to a town that has some ammo munitions. Maybe Reverend Swanson. I need ammo munitions. I can't go to Sandini. Where else can I go? Emerald Station have any weaponry? No. Go to Valentine. I'm gonna have to go to Valentine. You can just swap guns on a horse to a different one. You have you can, yeah. I would prefer to go ahead and stock up on everything, that way I don't have to continuously do it all over again. I'd rather be prepared, I guess is what I'm trying to say. Fast travel over there. Can I hitch my horse? Oh, I can hitch my horse over here. Alright. Hitch at the sheriff's office. <gasps> yeah, right. Ammo munition. Good, good. Good deal. 
You'll see a few people in town with that, too. All right. Now let's clean our stuff. This should be fun. That does not need to be cleaned. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. That one's good. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good this on you. Should be good because I haven't used it. The Mauser probably needs to be clean, you yeah. know. Why don't we enhance your gun? See how much more it can do. How about you get some new sights for this, huh? Did I not already upgrade this? Apparently I have not. Smoke break. Right on. Alright, that does nothing. Alright, let's get the carbine repeater. It's cleaned already. Beautiful condition. Keep it up. That's good. clean. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. Right, Springfield's you good. Like your own child, all right? Good on you. Bolt action needs to be cleaned. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I Rolling can see. Rolling rock I've used. All right. Well, I don't need to clean Beautiful it either. Condition. Keep it up. Sawed off. No. Nope. All right. You keep treating that like your own child, all right? Good on you. All right. Double barreled's good. Beautiful condition. Keep it up. I have used this quite. Well, no. Apparently not. Good. Ain't no trace of rust on that as far as I can see. Oh, hell, mister. You look like you've been all whiskey no stew. You all right? I've been better, but I'm okay. Alright. Get your paper. Okay, boy. So now we probably need to eat something, perhaps. And now we need to go fast travel back to Beaver Hollow. All right, that's easy. The saloon should have spirits. Yeah. Scoot on up into the woods over here. We'll fast travel up out. Travel back to Beaver Holler. I need to go and check on my coffee.
Coffee. Awesome. Back at camp. Awesome. Right, here we go. Get you up our horse. The food. What's the coffee? It is just plain old Starbucks espresso. Guessing Dutch doesn't want to be bothered. I still don't know where the freaking contribution box is around here anymore. If I knew where that contribution box was, things would be great. Ain't nobody making no food. Where's the... Where's the food wagon? There ain't no food in here. Okay. I thought it was just right up over there. They hadn't said anything yet, but who knows. Here, let's see what this uh, Reverend wants. Reverend? You okay, Mr. Morgan? Not really. I don't know, Reverend. These are challenging times for all of us. Yes, very challenging. You don't seem yourself somehow. I, I've always felt... I've left the morphine, sir. Oh, I'm in Reverend Swanson, would you excuse us a minute? Of course. You New mean? York. We are going to go to New York. Now, they have been chasing us south and east and west. We're going to get a boat. We're going to get on a river, and we're going to go north. New York. Then Tahiti, the Fiji Islands, or this place, New Guinea, dancing girls, freedom. But first, we have to make a whole lot of smoke, a whole lot of... Commotion, and then we disappear. We need more commotion. One score and one whole hell of a lot of noise. We ain't so good at doing scores anymore, Dutch. Are you feeling all right, Arthur? Sure, fine. Pardon me for interrupting. I brought a friend, Arthur. Hello. Hello. Dutch, this is Eagle Flash. His father is a great chief. Charles and I, we pretended to be mercenaries. Did me a great favor. <laughs> Dutch Vanderlyn, how do you do? Not well, sir. Well, I am sorry to hear that. How's your father? Father has confused wisdom with weakness. His people, my people, we've suffered too much, been lied to too much. Now they've taken our horses. Who? The infantry division posted at Fort Wallace. Why? Colonel Favors is a liar and a murderer. His people won't stop until we're all dead. Without horses, we cannot hunt. Without hunting, we will starve. This is another act of war. I see that. Men have helped me before, and I have money. Put your money away, son. What do you think, Charles? You know I told your father I will not fight over some horses. But I made no such promise. Come along. Yeah, Arthur, we must go with them to try to stop things from getting out of hand. I guess. Come along. We can. 
can get them more horses. I know. I understand Eagle Flies is angry, but I don't see how this will help anything. Especially not with Dutch whipping them up into a frenzy. We got enough folks coming after us without adding an army to the list. Thank you for this. You going to let these <laughs> bastards walk all over you? No, you're not. This is all that's wrong with this world. Okay, young man, lead the way. The horses are on a boat near Van Horn. I have a man waiting for us there with some canoes. Surely this can be done without killing anyone. Of course. What will be, will be. Anyway, son, tell me about this Colonel Favors. He's a vile man. He and his regiment take pleasure of persecuting us. All the young have been taken from our reservation, shipped off to reform schools. Many women, too. The old are weak and sick, but they deliberately withhold medicine and supplies from us. <laughs> this ends today. You have my word on that. Yeah, Wood's got quite a few hours. That's true. And that dude has got a... He has a very shiny horse. Look at Dutch's horse. Why are you getting involved oh. in this, Dutch? You know me. We shoot fellers as need shooting. We Come on. No, no, no. Stop. Horse. Not this again. It's been quite a while since we helped anyone but ourselves. And even you know that. I told you. Noise. We need noise, Arthur. Noise. And faith. I still don't know what that means. Stop questioning and think. Just think for a second. The Pinkertons have had time to reinforce. The civilized world is closing on us. Who knows what else Molly told them? We need to move towards a conclusion now. Sure, but what's this got to do with any of that? Some good, honest conflict between the army and the Indians might be just the distraction we need. Kill two birds with one stone. Cornwall was funding the Pinkerton's assault on us. Why do you think I dealt with him? With Cornwall gone, the government is far more likely to divert them to other issues, especially if there's one more scandal. And then we can slip away. Like I said, we just need that noise and one more score. You know, I went back to the chest I had hidden outside Shady Bell, and we're close, Arthur. That dynamite? The railroad contract with the army, it was all in those papers Micah found. I have a plan. You just have to trust me. Okay. Is that coffee? Yeah, it's coffee. Oh. There's Peter. I wanted my guns. These men, like I said, they'll help us. I got the canoes. The boat is still moored in the channel. Good. Come on, let's go. I need my guns off my boat, yo, or off my horse. Wait, let me back. We need to get that boat ashore. I think the best plan is to paddle up there. Yeah, the horse drive. Yeah. Border. And when we got control, we'll deal with that anchor and float away. <laughs> we'll be ashore before anybody even knows what happened. And that canoe is going fast over there.
Maybe I shouldn't do that, actually. Maybe I can sneak up on Gotta be right. Look what we got here. Hold on. Who the hell? This Whoops. We'll take it back. What's all? Oh no no, what are you doing? Get up! Ooh! No! So how am I... Try not to kill anyone, Arthur. Supposed to subdue the soldier here. Stealth knockout? Oh, that's how we do it. Got it. You mind the horses? I need a smoke. Got him. Very good. God damn it, no. I'm out. Alright. How am I supposed to get this done here? There's all of them right there. I'm going to get this one. Hopefully they'll get the others. What the hell? Take it back. What's ours? Maybe dead eye all of them. Maybe. Dynamite. You think I have the first idea how this anchor works? Just blow it up then. Hurry. Or with a knife. Yeah, thank you. Dutch is a dumb ass. <laughs> what is wrong with you? The boys all right back there? Yeah, I think so. But there's a huge hole in the boat. Horses are spooked, and we're taking on water. The boys, get them out of here. Oh, oh. Well, whatever else is wrong with you, you're quite the best pilot I've ever come across. The horses are confused. We need to round them up. I'll get these four, Arthur. Can you go after the others? Okay. Come on. Over here. Come on. Come here. All right. 
Horse's <clears throat> stamina is wailing, waning, should I say. Sam likes you fellas even less than he likes us. So it goes. My father doesn't want to fight again. Will one of you help me return the horses to my men? Well, Arthur... Oh, Arthur needs to rest. I will. I like you, son. And after the horses, are we going to wait for the army to come and wreak its revenge? I hope not. Of course we ain't. Now let's go check out that fort of theirs. Is this a good idea? This is the only idea. And it is one that will suit both of our purposes. Fighting the army ain't wise. Stop worrying. Oh, and Sadie told me about Cone. Meet us at Doyle's Tavern in San Denis when you can. Shall we go, son? San Denis. We'll start some light reconnaissance out at Fort Wallace, and when Combs dealt with, you come meet us there. We'll set up a good spot for you. I don't know, Dutch. Yeah, well, I do. This is exactly the distraction that we need. Your father said that fighting was an impossible gamble. There's no winning for you in this. Your father need not know anything. He'd rather live in ignorance. Come along, gentlemen. Your father would rather you did not do anything so foolish. I said I would stop this from happening. Would you talk to him? Speak with Rangeful. Yes. Would you? Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll help. Sure. Oh. I'll speak with him. Because Dutch is an a hole. Go back to camp, check on the others. Dutch's behavior. It's... I understand. Thank you, Arthur. Yay! Now, what are our options? We got rain weapons forbidden. That's it, rains fall. Like uh, that, steal the wagon of explosives on the So we have to do that. We have to Sadie Henry Lemieux. How are we gonna do any of this without getting killed? And we gotta go help Rains Falls. I think we should go and help Rains Falls. I think that that's what we should do. So, where are we? We're over here. We can travel to Valentine, then go up to Rains Falls. There we go. Valentine, then rains falls. Actually, let's sleep until morning and then we'll fast travel.
camps tore down. I forgot to fast travel. Duh. He can keep that entire tent in his little satchel there. That's pretty impressive. Go back over to Valentine. Yeah, the fish fit in there too. It's very true. But we can't fit any other wild game. Just just the fish. No meal is complete if it don't got meat. Mm. Okay. So from here we go north. All the way up there. Playing with something, sorry you noticed something. Okay. Have fun. Let me know if you find anything interesting. I've never been to this territory, I'm excited. twisted my ankle something fierce think you could give me a ride yeah yeah sure hop on oh thank you sir thank you you know emerald ranch mind taking me there i gotta oh. be nice glad i ran into you huh i raised that horse you know raised it since it was just a foal Hey, we can't walk your horse back. Come on! Okay, I want to search his saddlebag first. Just gonna hey, help you out with your you doing? Get back on your horse. with your belongings. Okay, boy. Let's go. I just wanted to help you out with your belongings. That's all. <clears throat> uh, losing a horse is hard. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, that horse did right by me. Better than my husband, truth be told. That fool, always complaining, but does he do something about it? Man barely lifts his hand to wave the flies away, aside from to lift a drink, of course. Marriage for me has been nothing but trouble. But Biscuit, he was a fine animal. Loyal, smart, brave. Didn't take no guff, not from no one. Had one of them mountain boys pull a gun on me once. I was riding up near the Dakota and had stopped by a nice warm patch. Must have dozed off, but I wake up and find some nasty piece of work pointing a rusty shotgun straight at me. Well, he gets wheezing on and I must have made some sort of noise because the next thing I know, Biscuit had nipped his ear clean off. <laughs> Kicked his hide too as he was hollering away. Didn't think a man could run so fast. Oh, yeah? Yeah, had a good laugh on that one. <laughs> I tell the husband, what does he do? Should have never gone over there, honey, he says. Gee, thanks. <coughs> so, you're 
I think you might have got twisted now? around. So, where was I? Oh, yes. For the time being, I was looking for work. They was looking for some help with the gardens. If I waited any longer for my husband to put food on the table, I'd have died of starvation. I'll be moving on soon, though. Emerald Ranch, well, it's a strange place. How so? The owner's a mean bastard. Strange, too. Delights in bullying folk. There's a daughter, but she never leaves the house. You can see her in the window sometimes. When I asked about her, everybody told me to leave it alone. Found an old saloon there, all shut down now. But I went in to have a look, and there's bullet holes, old blood stains. Something definitely happened there, but I couldn't figure it. Just an uncomfortable feeling to the place. Either way, it's time I left. Especially now I lost that poor horse. I'll collect my belongings and be on my way. Back home? I guess. I bet my husband's right where I left him. Bottle in hand. This ride <clears throat> seems like it's a pretty good distance. Yeah, she was drunk. That's why she wrecked her horse. Up and died on her. Oh, we're getting close now. See that? Watch it. You watch it. You in the way. Emerald Ranch. This is great. Thanks. This was kind of you, mister. Please, take this as my way of thanking you. <laughs> Appreciate it. What'd she give what me? What a lousy day. What did she give me? I don't know. Is there anything in Emerald Ranch? Fence. I need to go to the fence. I do, I do, I do. I can sell some stuff. Hmm. Okay, been a while cool. Since you were through here. All right, take a look. We'll sell some stuff. Oh, you got something for me? Do anything that's in crafting. I'm not gonna sell. Anything that is crafting, I'm oh, gonna keep. Yes. Anything that cannot be used. All the time. Yeah, make sell anything that's excessive. Street, no doubt. Hmm. Come across a few of these myself. All these wooden. Oh yes. People lose these all the time. Right, that can be used for crafting. It's hundred and fifty five dollars for the Rutlinger's watch. I'm gonna keep that. I got plenty of money now, so we're gonna roll well, out. Good doing business with you. Okay. All right. Boy. Not a word. What's that? You can play dominoes. All right. Now we're going back up here to Rain's Fall. Rain Falls or whatever it is. Time is it? 12.07 p.m. Saving is a good idea. You're, you're, thank you. <laughs>
I'm gonna go on the trail. I'm gonna take the more direct route. <clears throat> Interesting. Yep. Yeah. That's really odd. Why does it say I have to go that way if my waypoint's like way over here? Riding on no trail. I'm riding through the wilderness. Got down there on a horse, I don't want to mess with him. I'm headed to help out my uh, friend Raining Falls, or whatever his name is. Rain Falls. Uh, yes it is. Metal Gear Solid alert. Everybody loves that thing, except for my wife. She says it's toxic. I can hear it in my pocket. Oh, sir, just in nope. Time. Yep. You thought it was your phone, you have the same thing? See, I'm not alone! Anybody that knows anything about video games thinks it's awesome. But I shouldn't say that. A lot of people that know something about video games think it's awesome. Yeah. Poor rabbit. Good boy. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> Poor rabbit. Yeah. Got owned by a horse foot. <laughs> Fine, we'll take the long way around. We'll take the scenic route. Hey, feller. From Metal Gear Solid 5, I have the iDroid new message received for text, new email message received. Nice. My horse wants to be brushed. All right. Let's brush you. Hey, come on, boy. Relax. You okay? A little boy? bit of horse bonding. You know, go around to the other side. Need some more brushing. Let's get you looking nice. Want some food? Yeah. Eat this, boy. Yeah. We could probably use something to eat ourselves. shotgun down here. Right. Yep. 
two cheese wheels and heads of cabbage. <laughs> Wow, that's some blue water. That is like super pretty. Wow. Get all them fish. Wow. Oh wow, that's beautiful too. Here we go. Northern Arizona, Southern Utah. I could, oh, yeah. Yep, yep, all this red, this red clay. Yep, Wapiti. I cannot use uh, weapons in this area, okay. PD reservation. All right. That's my next thumbnail. It might be. Perhaps you could help us. Is there a place where I may hitch my horse? I wonder if I could trade. They got a watermelon. I think I'm dying. And I hope you find peace. Well, I don't know too much about peace. Apparently not. Did you have fun with my son, the impetuous prince? I believe you went on a raid with him. <sighs> um, uh, I'm sorry. I suppose I lack the grandeur of a conventional king. I don't know too many kings. <laughs> Colonel Favors. He has already exacted some measure of revenge for the raid. Two women were assaulted by his men. Um, I'm very sorry about all of this. Yes. Sometimes the correct path, the bravest path, is the least obvious and also the gentlest. I'm, I'm a great disappointment to my son. Your son seems to want a war. My son thinks there is glory in death. Maybe he's right, but for me, I saw death being handed out so freely by the most foolish of men, I never could equate it with victory. Glory has come in service. Maybe. Maybe not, I don't know. I've killed a lot of people. For a whole lot of dumb reasons, and I ain't never seen much glory in it. Well, oh, your friend, Mr. Vanderlyn, he talks a lot. I don't know him, but my son is easily lit. I'm not sure I get you. Uh, well, perhaps we could go for a ride. I'm an old man. My whole life I have tried to bring peace. But uh, I ain't doing so good. Then maybe you can take pity on my plight, please. It won't take long. <coughs> and maybe I can help you with that cough. Sir! Hmm. I'm glad I caught you, sir. Captain Monroe, do you know my friend, Mr. Morgan? No, sir. I don't have the pleasure. Arthur Morgan. It's an honor, sir. How can I help you, Captain? I was just in San Denis. I spoke with the mayor. It's not good news, I'm afraid. May I ride with you for a little? Of course. I've got to go to the restroom Follow again. Me. So where are we going? I want to show you a site up in the mountains that's long been sacred to me. 
A place for reflection. Okay. Well, I'm going to go to the restroom while we do that. Okay. And healing. Sorry what about is that. this news, Captain Munro? Yes, sir. As I mentioned, I did speak again with the mayor and the Bureau of Indian Affairs in Saint Denis at length. But regrettably, it appears the oil company has already received approval to move forward with drilling on the reservation's land. I suppose there's much. So what does that mean for us now? I'm not sure just yet. I didn't get the impression anything would be happening for a few months. I'm very sorry, sir. I did everything I could. I know, Captain. And I assure you I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? I would rather certain actions were taken by friends outside the tribe. Even just a couple hours of your time. Sure, I can help. That's good news. Thank you. Come meet me on the reservation whenever you can. Okay. Anyway, gentlemen, I won't take up any more of your time. I'll see you both soon. Sure. Thank you, Captain. Enjoy the ride. I have some other business to attend to, Mr. Morgan. We'll continue on this way. I'm going to look for some herbs to give you. Well, thank you. Okay. <clears throat> See the wolves over there feasting on that horse? Brutality uh, and beauty no. are both all around us. Yet so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Oh, that, that. There was no need to harm them. Okay. We can talk if you want, Mr. Morgan. But don't feel like you have to. Are you all right back there? It's best we stay together now. So anyway. It's a beautiful ride ahead if you need some time to think. So, we don't know each other too well, but I wanted to speak to you about your son. 
I was there on the raid to steal back those horses, and, uh, well... Sorry, uh, hold up a moment. That'll have to wait. Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Okay. This is what I was looking for. English mace. Okay. Let's continue on. You were saying before you rode off? Well... You know something of Dutch, I think. Yes, a little. Mostly from your friend Charles. I don't know why Dutch is getting involved in your situation. And this ain't easy to say, but I just don't trust that he's got your son's best interests at heart. So what can we do? I don't rightly know. Charles and I just thought you should be aware. Maybe there's a way to stop things from getting any more out of control. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Let me give this some thought. Be careful. <coughs> There are some steep <coughs> up ahead, but the views <coughs> are beautiful from up here. <coughs> Ugh. Yeesh. Things that bad on a reservation? Yes. This conflict with Colonel Favors and his regiment at Fort Wallace continues to worsen. Many of the elders are sick, and the young feel that any Thank compromise. You is an admittance of defeat. Well, we ain't done much to calm the situation. But I have... Wait, stop here. I want to pick some ginseng. We can talk more about this later. Why didn't he just ride his horse up to the ginseng? <laughs> just went to go and look over the freaking cliff. I wasn't I was within his sign of light. Jeez. Fine. Things that bad on the reservation. Yes. This conflict with Colonel Favors and his regiment at Fort Wallace continues to worsen. Many of the Wait, I went to go for a look a I view. Some ginseng. And it said that I abandoned him. Later. <clears throat> I can't go up to the edge without ruining I was I was right there within his line of sight but I abandoned him Wait there I'll put these in your saddlebag Get on my horse fool Oh that's not my horse that's your horse <laughs> It tastes awful, but it'll help to keep your strength up. Okay, thank you. All right, let's go. It's not much further now. What was I talking about? Ah, but then his line of sight. Many of the elders are sick, yeah. and the young feel that any compromise is an admittance of defeat. Well, we ain't done much to calm the situation. But I have to continue to seek to resolve matters through peaceful negotiation. War would be futile. Your people are lucky to have you. I'm not so sure about that. Ah! The Night Feller. Monroe. Thanks, I didn't know him. Captain Monroe was reassigned here from a regiment. Conflict has spread all the way to Washington. 
He's a good man. He wants to help. Well, I guess that's something at least. I'm the glad that you've had fun, men. man. Just as my people aren't all good, but this Colonel favors. <clears throat> he walks an old lion. He's obstinate and he hates Monroe. I just hope between us we can work this out. Day two, you've effectively entertained me and I've missed out on an opportunity to play myself. Well, I'm glad that, that I could entertain you. Sorry you haven't been able to play the game, but at least you're enjoying yourself here and I'm very grateful to be part of it. I've literally just been searching Red Dead 2 all weekend and watched over a dozen streamers try supporting people with no response, but I like the little community you have here. Oh, thank you. We, uh, we're a small community, but we're a friendly group. We've known each other, most of us, for a couple of years now. At least a year, a lot of us. I mean, you, you see the, the badges. But. I know, these mountains are gorgeous. What's going on? What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong, bro? Bro! Chill. They destroyed everything. Yes, they now did. I just need to find the Chalupa. Chalupa? Who, who would do this? What? Someone who wanted to enrage you. Help me look around, please! <clears throat> the Chinupa is gone. Of course. Alright, here's a couple uh, clues. Pipe. There must be some clues to what happened here. Army flask. Whiskey. <laughs> Bastards are having a party up here. This is a place of peace. Wait. Another one over here. Whiskey soaked logs. This is what that's all about. Uh, there's some logs here they must have used as kindling. Some up here. Another whiskey bottle. Okay. Um, I come. <laughs> An empty bottle of whiskey. Well, if they drank all that, they couldn't have gotten too far. Yeah, well, still no sign of the Chinupa. Chinupa, not Chalupa. All right. Chinupa. Just left it as he found it. Uh. Buddy, need to wake you up a bit. I'm gonna wait. Look there, smoke. Uh -uh. Come on, where are you at? Smoke. Holy sh! That's what you meant by waking me up, dude. Whoa. Holy shit, dude. MK, bro. Bro. Dude. Dude, bro. You you get a canoe, ser a canoe serenade. We're going to serenade you with a canoe. Holy cow, man. Thank you so much. That's, that's extremely kind and generous of you. I really appreciate that. Everybody, welcome MK to the BGP fam. Dude, you're so, so amazing. Thanks for hanging out, bro. Like, seriously. This is so much fun. Some of Colonel Favors, man. I, mean, I gotta get you on the board, too, buddy. Uh, two boards, in fact. I wasn't expecting that much noise, but it gets the job done. Yeah, bro. Dude. Absolutely. 
<laughs> well, would you like to pick a color? I have many colors to choose from. Um, from orange to blue to red to green to hot pink. Um, yeah. Um, <laughs> I got two boards to put you on, man. Thank you so much. Let's freaking go. Those boards, all the members on that board right here, and super chatters are a slash channel support for the uh, other one. So members typically go on both boards, usually, but today we got MK right here in blue. Big M, big K, big smiley face. And since my... Uh, my green screen is actually blue. It's uh, see-through. So <laughs> on here, you will be see-through, but rest assured, you are still here. I'm going to dedicate an entire corner in the top right-hand corner of the board to our newest member, MK, which is red unless I angle it enough right there. Smiley face, you guys are awesome. And the other one right there. MK, thank you so much, bro. Round of applause one more time, and let's go. Are you surprised this happened? Not at all. But, but I hope we were past this. Now you got land they want. Land with oil. I need to eat. We moved us here. They've taken everything we had. I Bingo. signed three treaties myself, and they've broken hey, each one. Tony's still around. No, they've taken the last hope. <laughs> now my people are going to want a war. <laughs> A war they can't win. Not if I get it back. Get it back? What's this dude doing? Yeah, I'm gonna go in, get your chinupa, no one will be any the wiser. <laughs> chinupa. Wow. Would you do that? Well, you can't go, they know why you'd come. Do I need cold weather gear? I need some stuff on my horse. Yeah. Don't have any money. No, I don't need your money. I don't need your money. No. I do not need your money. Please see if they have our sacred items. But try not to hurt anyone. I'll try. I'll try to ensure that they never even know I'm there, but yeah. Yeah. actions don't always go the way you plan. Get to the camp. All right, let's try not to break an ankle. You said you were going to look for the Chinumpa. Mm-hmm. I am. My horse is over here. <laughs> so I'm going to go get my horse first. Here. Let me on my horse. Horse, horse. Come on, boy. Alright. So, let me look at the map. Oh, maybe I don't... items cold weather gear and I need to get to there now waypoint okay. let's go what am I putting away oh the binoculars yeah. 
The white Arabian is in the stable. <laughs> She's good. Or he's good. White Arabian's in the stable. It's all all gravy. Look at that view. It's crazy. I want to see that view again. I want to go west so bad. These little hills they call mountains around here just, just ain't it. Still watching. Ooh. There's people up here. Search the camp for the sacred items. didn't see nobody more suited for battle yeah, I really just don't have much experience um, with them so come down here and I'm gonna wait till night time must be imagining thing what is that horse doing over there with all them people Wait until night time. Where's my horse? It's not gonna let me camp, I bet. There's too much activity around. Yeah? It will let me camp. Nice. Instead of cream, it's Coca-Cola. White Russian, Black Russian. Interesting. All right, so it's gonna sleep till night time. That way, we're gonna have a better opportunity to sneak up on these people. Here. Yeah, yeah, we got the bow and the throwing knives. Um, thing about it, uh, the the chief didn't want us to kill anybody so I kind of want to do it without killing anybody I mean it's an option I just don't want to just don't want to hurt nobody if I don't have to Hoping everybody's gonna be asleep. I might be able to stealth knock out this guy. No, there's a lot of them.
<laughs> Maxi chimpanzee. <laughs> All good. Stealth kill. I'm gonna have to. Gotta go. Gotta go. Come on. Shush. I am wanted. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Let's go. Get on that horse. Move, horse, horse, get on. Oh, shoot. Fall was abandoned. But what are you talking about? What are you talking about? <sighs> huh? Weird. But okay. I know how to complete the mission next time. my horsey coming up across the mountain top why don't you come down here all right boy let's get up I'll get it next time yeah it's all right um need to go to you This way. Can I make it up that? I can make it up that. Shoot, man. We're just gonna go this way. Forget it. There we go. It says I can go up this path? Really? Oh, there's the path. I see. Alright. your things I think yes thank you I'm very sorry about this even sacred things are only things people the heart matter more was anyone hurt oh no one was killed okay well done well done I wish my son knew such restraint my people owe you a great debt. Yeah, lucky. And I'm mm. giving you very little. But please, take this. We believe it to be sacred. Thank you. 
Thank you. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. Okay. <clears throat> He's a man who, not so long ago, I would have found weak and pathetic. Now I see as wise and thoughtful and sensible. I would love to help him. Or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do something real stupid. What idiot built that hut in the middle of a path? Yeah. All right, let's check out our map, see what we got to do. Save first. That's the most important thing. All right. We could go bird watching. Wow. Plenty of fish down here, too. Okay. Okay. Um. The things that we need to do. get out of this there we go this right here is stranger encounter captain monroe is up there and then we still have micah and then we also have sadie So, the order of operations. I think we need to... How much should I get done since getting the White Arabian? A uh, few missions. Do I want to meet the veteran? Yeah, let's do that. Let's meet the veteran. And then we will head on up to the reservation. Mm. Okay. Let's go. Where are you at, horse? Come on. Thank you. Okay, boy. Yeah. Here we go. Oh, that wasn't far at all. Easy now. That wasn't far at all. Hey! You there? Can you help? <laughs> Sir! Some help! Can you help me, mister? What's the problem? My goddamn horse got spooked and run off. Are you hurt? Not too bad, at least. But he took my damn leg. Sorry. He went that way, I think. His name's Buell. 
Buell? Second time a prick named Buell cost me a leg. Huh? Buell was my general when I lost it. Oh, uh, okay. Anyway, if you see an angry bastard of a horse with my wooden leg, I'd be real grateful. <clears throat> I'll bear that in mind. Okay. Let's search nearby for this guy. Let's go. Oh, there he is down at the river. Yep. Whoa, easy. Um, the animal symbols, it's like a legendary uh, hunting, I do believe. Come on, Dan. Let's get you back. Yeah. Hey, he's just where you left him. Can't go far with that leg in your stirrup. Can't go bucking him like that. You better be good, you hear? This is a horse. I get the notion he's not a man you want to cross. No matter how big and strong you are. I wonder if I could ride it. Probably not. It'd probably not like me very much. This is a, a long fetch mission. Sinclair. Yeah, he's a great horse, aside from when the devil got him. Hey, you want to hand me that leg there, please? And while you're at it, give old Buell a kick for me, would you? No, I'm only kidding. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> Warren, but a snake that spooked him. You're a real gentleman, you know? Sometimes, maybe. Yeah, how'd you lose a leg? Oh, in the war. Cannonball. Pretty clean, though. I don't have much pain, and I didn't get any gangrene. Young boy went into battle with me, got cut in half, so all things considered, I'm doing pretty well, I guess. Yeah, I guess. So, uh, how is the false one? It's okay. I can still hunt, fish, 
Enjoy the outside. Weren't sent too crazy by it. Anyway, I ain't got much to pay you with. You know, that's okay. You like fishing? You can come with me someday. I know some pretty good spots. Uh, I'm a pretty poor fisherman. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm great. So between the two of us, we do okay. <laughs> My cabin is right over on the other side of O'Cray's run there. Thanks again. You throw me again, you old dumb bastard. I'm gonna put a bullet in you. <laughs> I'll see you again. Hey, cool. That was nice. Alright. Now where shall we go? Uh no. Map. Going north. Captain Monroe. That's the waypoint. We're in the wilderness. We should be able to fast travel there. There it is. That's fine. Horse won't gallop. Oh. oh I'll get off the horse. Mr. Morgan. Hello. Hello. Here I am, as promised. Rain's fall said an outsider was helping. This could be him. Captain Monroe. Of course. Chief's going out trying to find medications. It's quite a business. Yes. I thought we were through with all of this. Well, we are, mostly. Colonel Faber seems to think the natives have broken some promise they never made, and apparently he's punishing them by withholding vaccines sent down by the federal government. Really? Mm -hmm. I was supposed to oversee the administration of vaccines. Now I hear the wagon's been diverted. Why would he do such a thing? <sighs> to be honest, I truly don't know. They say he didn't have a very good war, so maybe he's trying to start another one. Is that what you think? I'm trying to find out. And he knows I'm trying to find out. He'd love to provoke me almost as much as he'd love to provoke these poor bastards. Meaning? <sighs> Meaning that despite the fact that I think he's a horse's ass, he knows I think that. So we're just stuck here trying to make the best of things. This is the best of things. Children dying of diseases. No. This is awful. Where is this wagon? Where can we find it? I can show you. It's supposed to be heading to a pediatric coming up through Valentine, but it's been diverted south instead. Come on, Captain Monroe. Uh, Mr. Morgan, we must act with due caution. Oh, we shall. We surely shall. Now come. This chapter's okay. on here. I think I know a spot where we should be able to intercept it. Okay. Get away, Captain. So, this Colonel Faber, he knows you're up here helping these people? Yes, and no. He knows I'm here to produce a report on the situation. I was sent down from the north after all the news of unrest in the region. But I think my presence might be making things worse. What do you mean? I worry he's taking some of these actions more to protect himself now. He can incite more retaliation, maybe he can prove a stronger defense. 
Sound well, like destroying that shrine. Yes, and taking their horses. I mean, I don't know if he personally sanctioned any of this or not. This is the other problem. There's a culture now in his regiment. The rot has traveled down the trunk. Okay. Well, just show me where to find this wagon, and I'll get the medicine for you. You don't need to be involved. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. But I must ask you, please be discreet. We really cannot afford more conflict. I'm still hoping a meeting can be arranged between Rain's Falls and Colonel Favors. Those green uniforms look so uh, interesting. Back at the <laughs> I agree with that. Oh no, 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 no! You only need to commandeer the back seat. Stealing those and an army wagon will only make matters much worse. Okay. You know, much prefer blue. Favors has many flaws, but I don't believe he's callous. More an insecure man at the end of his career, trying to cling on to something that's already gone. He fought for the Union in the war, and his record was considered far from illustrious. A failed man is often the most dangerous. Oh, boy. Yeah, if I'm thinking correctly, I've seen uh, some army dress uniforms that looked kind of, kind of odd, really. All right, this is the spot I was thinking of. Yeah. Let's cut up this way. Sure. There's a nice vantage point up at the top here. Dismount here. Best leave the horses back a bit. We'll have a good view over the road from this ledge. Now the wagon should come along this way. Okay. You're a good man, Mr. Morgan, but I fear this task to be a fool's errand. Well, firstly, I'm a long way from a good man. Secondly, fool's errands are my favorite kind of work. Fair enough. In that case, I can see we shall be great friends. <laughs> May I ask you a question? Of course. Why don't you just tell all the folk up in Washington what kind of an idiot Colonel Favors is and save us all a lot of bother? There you go. Uh, unfortunately, the government doesn't work quite like that. If you say so. There. I think that's the wagon. All right. Get yourself <clears throat> out of here. I just remember to keep it clean. Understand me? Don't worry. I'm as clean as they come. All I do is clean. Mm. Well, good luck. I'll meet you back at the reservation. Try not to get yourself killed, Mr. Morgan. No, no, I, I can't promise. I need my horse to come over here. Let's go, boy. Yep. Yeah, they had to have gone this way. I'm on a single horse. They're on a wagon. Surely I should be able to catch up with them. There they are. Yeah. I wonder how I do this. I can just jump onto the wagon and steal the supplies. Hold it right there! Whoa, you better put that down right now. Do you want to 
get shot, is that it? Come on. Guess my hat's gone now. Gonna need your cargo feathers. Are you insane? Where the United States are? Um. What is y'all's problem? I'm gonna have the entire army on me here. This is not gonna work. I don't know. Alright, let's just retry this. Because I don't see how I'm supposed to do this unless. Oh, I can just. Oh no, I mean. Hey, don't get too close to this wagon. Hold it right there. Whoa, you better put that down right now. Yeah. Come on, horse. I'm gonna need your cargo feathers. Are you insane? We're the United States Army. That's it. Shoot that thing. You're already. Jack hole. <laughs> yep, yep. Oh yeah, you gotta put the bandana on your face. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Search the wagon. Yeah, you can put on a thing, a bandana on your face, sure can. Well, we didn't exactly do what we were out to do, but we got it done. So, uh, mission accomplished, sort of. They were being jerks about it. They were going to shoot me, so I just took care of business. I might have been able to, I mean, it would have been cool if I would have been able to, like, sneak up and, like, uh, jumped onto the wagon. Yeah, mission accomplished as far as getting the medicine. I think, I'm, I don't know, I think it said something about trying to do it without killing people, but whatever. 
bad man, yeah. And then I got like negative uh, good boy points for looting the guy. That was <laughs> that was funny. There's a waterfall over there. It's pretty double waterfall. Dang. I'll go down there and see this. <laughs> exactly, they have. All of them have ended up in everybody dying. So true. I'm gonna get off and look around for a minute here. <laughs> this man's gonna be <laughs> hunt you down, sleep with one eye open, you know? Yep. Yep. Uh, is it just me? I have YouTube on 1080p. Or like 480p that's why I asked about it right earlier maybe it's my internet um I am broadcasting at currently 60 between 6230 and 6425 I got my bitrate set at 6000 and it's only dropped between there's only dropped below like five grand once um I'm showing zero drop frames on my end um but that really doesn't mean too much um if you're not getting the signal, you're not getting the signal. Um, and that's no good. I was having that problem with Twitch earlier um, today. Well, yesterday now. Uh, it was... Uh, it was horribly... Horribly delayed. Might just be YouTube. Very well could be. See, I like these people. They don't mind hitching up their horses inside of their town here. I want to live with these people, not my stuck-up crew that won't let me bring my horse to my own tent. Alright, you want to cook this up into some medicine for us? Or something? Wait, it's a vaccine. It doesn't need to be cooked up into medicine. I got the medicine. A lot of volume, Wonderful. yeah. That's great yeah. news, Mr. Morgan. Yeah, well, don't worry. It, uh, midnight Cal or 1 a.m. California back. time, too. So. Oh, I'll have to take your word for that. We could both swing for this. <laughs> yeah, well, I think I'm a little past caring about hanging, Monroe. Maybe. I just hope Colonel Favors thinks he was robbed by bandits and not... Oh, no, I'm still a bandit. There ain't no doubt about that. Of course. Well, I better get to work. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Bandit or not, this was a good thing. Maybe it'll get us both killed, but it had to be done. I <laughs> hope so. Ding dong. We've done good. Let's talk to some people around here, see what they have to say. Hello, ma'am. You are not welcome here. Why not? I thought it was cool here. Hello, gentlemen. Whatever you're looking for, this isn't the place. Y'all are awfully welcoming. Mister, I want no dealings with you. You all are mean people. Mean, mean people. All right, good horse. Let's brush the other side here. Uh, 
Have it on the big screen. Still here for the experience and social aspect. Obviously, with me being a chatterbox. <laughs> hey, man. I'm glad you're here. I normally watch YouTube on the big screen, too. I, I've got a computer hooked up to both TVs. So I like to I like to run the laptop through the HDMI or whatever. And yeah, lots of fun. And uh, downstairs, I've got my uh, other computer, my other tower set up. Uh, entertainment room or whatever. All right, let's go back to... Here. It's a long way. I'm going to fast travel. Uh, what I read told me streaming 1080p was at 12,000 bit rate was a waste, but I found 7 to 9,000 be a sweet spot, but you upgraded your internet for it. Yeah, I was going by what uh, Twitch standards was, and um, it might have, it might be different. But yeah, I see what you're saying. 1200 is just, that's insane. I've got gig speed. Or like, I've got Whoa. Whoa. There we go. Yeah, I've got tons of uh, internet bandwidth to play with, so I can set it at whatever. Should be okay. It's so pretty. I never take this many screenshots in a game. Six thousand isn't worth it, but dropped rates. They say above six thousand isn't worth it. Yeah. That's kinda kinda where I was at. And just a screenshot. How fast are my download and upload speeds? Right now, while I'm streaming. I'll do it while I'm streaming and tell you what I'm getting. I am on Twitch. I don't. Why are you not seeing messages? That I don't know. Maybe reload your page. Um, so right now it says I have 475.4 Mbps download and 155.0 upload while I'm streaming. So let me do it again. Uh, my internet service provider has this really strange thing of throttling it until I use it. So it, like it, I have to tell it that I'm about to use some major bandwidth. And then it'll like instantly boost it to uh, to what I need it to be. So on a retest, I've got 602.2 Mbps download and 468.3 Mbps upload. Um, hopefully that uh, that answers any questions uh, about that. Uh, CPU usage according to OBS is 2.9 and 2.4 percent. Uh, according to my stream deck, it is uh, overall PC CPU usage is uh, hovering around anywhere between 12 and 18 percent. It spiked to 24 when I swapped scenes here, when I swapped folders. But, uh, Um, I go above 6,000 so that if it throttles, I keep better quality. I spent a year streaming the whole time. It was a learning experience. You'll start back up one day. Cool. What did you stream when you were streaming? Let's 
it's uh I don't want to get like into a topic you don't want to talk about but I'm interested in meeting other streamers and seeing what they're up to how they've done things you know the f the other side of playing video games on the internet <laughs> All right. <clears throat> Six fifty three PM. Probably need to eat food. That's good. And we'll set up camp. Travel back to, uh, what you call it. You know, we can just travel back there and sleep the night. That's an idea. Go back to Beaver Hollow and sleep for the evening in our own tent we hardly ever use. I love how it just populates right there instead of fully loading in before this the scene generates. And before the scene is shown. Wait, I need to hitch the horse. Good night, Karen. Good night, Karen. Have a wonderful evening, Karen. Oh, wow. That's pretty good, Jesse. Why is Karen being a Karen? Let's go talk to you. Look out, Trelawney. Josiah? I, um, I was, uh... Leaving again? Yes, just leaving. I'll see you soon. <coughs> Perhaps. Uh, what do you mean? Well, if I was you, I'd disappear too. This is all pretty much over. <laughs> but... I'll be back. No, you won't. Let's not pretend no more. Get out of here. I'll miss you, Arthur. You've been a fine friend to me. No, no let's not get over sentimental. Come on. The place is quiet. Get out of here. You go with my blessing. Thank you, Arthur. Okay. Good enough. Found a friend looking for you. Mr. Morgan. Sir. How are you? A little better. I hope so. How can I help you? I'm sorry to impose on you again, but I believe I've made progress brokering peace. You have? I believe so. Colonel Favors has agreed to a meeting to discuss and maybe resolve his alleged grievances and mine. Now, he has lied to me more times than I care to remember, but maybe this time... He must want peace. Why could he possibly want to humiliate us further? Well, we got words for his kind, but they're colloquial. Ah, 
Perhaps I could make one last request. My men are not allowed to carry arms. You want us to keep the peace? Yeah, it'll be a lot of dull talking and ceremony. But I feel with some non-tribe members present, their chances of lying or worse will be reduced. Will you, Arthur? Mm -hmm. It ain't my business, brother. No, I know. But it is mine. Do it for me. Charles, I got... I've saved your life. Do it for me. Sure. Come on. Okay. You owe this man. You should have him do your negotiations. Let's go. Jesse, or not Jesse, uh, okay. Ain't a problem. Just hope nobody recognizes me. I've had a few run-ins with the army recently. I wish we could have done more to control the situation. Dutch should not have gotten involved. My son has a mind of his own. Too much so, in fact. I just hope Colonel Favors can be reasoned with. I am not asking for very much. But when our people are sick and hungry, and we find our medicine and supplies are being deliberately withheld, how can we not view that as something personal? When they destroy our sacred sites, how can I convince Eagle Flies and the others that they shouldn't fight back? Maybe that's part of the reason they're doing these things. Because they want you to fight. Be able to say, look, you see how these savages behave? Perhaps. Thank you for helping Captain Monroe to retrieve those vaccines, Arthur. He will be at the meeting and is one person who knows the true situation, at least. I still have hope that we can come to an agreement. Okay. the trucks earlier uh, learning about ice and snow <laughs> I guess that was a load screen Excuse me. This way. It's long. It is. It, I, I would take a very long time to play this game for me if uh, if I didn't do this. I wasn't a streamer. Colonel Favors, Captain Munro, we come in... Stretching, by the way. Hello again. Who are these two? They're uh, friends of my people. Interesting looking fellows. Yeah, they won't cause any trouble. Well, I should hope not. Yeah. Listen, Mr. Um, Chief. Yeah. Yes, uh, Mr. I can't say that silly name, is it? In English, they call me Rainsfall. Yes, yes, I'm, uh, I'm sure they do. 
Listen, we're all Americans here, and we want an outcome. But quite frankly, quite frankly, I am confused. Your men are little more than criminals, in my opinion. <coughs> Keep breaking oh. peace treaties we've made, causing disturbances in everybody's lives. But I pride myself on being a gentleman. Really, I do. But there are limits. So, let me be very... Are you okay, man? Someone. Jackson, take him away. Where was I? Your gentleman with limits? Are you being facetious, sir? Come this way, buddy. I said, are you being facetious, oh Captain? <coughs> no, sir, I am not. Chief Reigns. That's, uh, Reigns' fault. Exactly. Yeah. Chief Reigns, the thing it's quite is, a cough. Sure. Wait here. I'll fetch you some water. I'll, I'll be fine. Thank you. Okay. No, no. You know he's going to have Monroe court-martialed. Or attempt to. He's going to make a disgrace of him. Monroe? He seems likable enough for a West Pointer. Why? You know what Favors is like. Because he thinks it's right. Because he thinks Monroe is a patsy. Or a spy. He's convinced he has something to do with those vaccines getting stolen. He thinks Monroe is going to force him into making a concession with the Indians. So he removes Monroe. Removes how? Favors wants him tried for treason. And hanged. Why does... Favors care about the Indians because he doesn't want to back down I mean, his whole professional life you know what they say about him high tail favors the man who missed a battle poor Monroe kind of liked him I know well still he's kind of stuck up your men violated the treaty that treaty is null and void I have been appointed to negotiate feel better <coughs> yeah come on Let's go. <coughs> the lands you currently occupy belong to the United States government. Why is this so confusing, sir? Why? Good day, Colonel Favors. Well, that was remarkably unproductive. <laughs> so, I'm afraid yeah. the federal government was quite clear, Colonel, that it wanted peace, and peace for all, and that the treaty had not been broken by anybody. Oh, is that so, sir? And did it want impudence, sir, from a junior officer in public? Was that its plan, too, sir? You insult me. You insult the regiment. Arrest this man. Arrest me? Gross insubordination. Disobeying an order. Treason. Are you mad? You had those vaccines stolen. You disrupted a negotiation. Let him go. This is all getting out of hand. Hi, right. Captain Monroe, let's get out of here. I, if I, I were you, I'd keep my mouth shut, amigo. I don't want to kill this man, but shall kill you. Charles, Captain Monroe, mount up now. We're getting out of here. Arthur, let's go. I got a shot. You son of a bitch. Let him go, okay? I got a shot. Open fire! Stop this way, come on! Whee! Whee! Get on the horse. Go get oh. Retry. Follow me. I would prefer to have a different gun there. Get thank you. All right, so that's what we have to do.
Go! See him. Oh, or is that you? No. Where is he? What's our plan here? Find oh. the make for the <sighs> you. Ooh, I need cover. <laughs> hey, Bean. Good morning. Come on. Come on, Captain. Can you shoot? I can't do it. They're Get the freaking cover, you fool. Alright, I need a rifle. Thank you. Got you. Got you. See you over there. Whoopsies. Alright, so behind us, that means I need to transition cover over to this side. Alright. This guy. Straight through the head. Nice. Where are you, buddy? Oh. Alright, you got hit. Where's the other one at? Oh. Ah, need you. Whoa! I am sorry, Mr. Morgan. I cannot kill these men. I am trying to help here. Oh, there's more. Now they're over here. How did this go so wrong? Come on, buddy. Got you. Do I loot? Do I have time to loot? Are they actually going to go without me? It doesn't look like it. I think I have time to loot. If not, then we're just going to have another fun fight here. Oh, return to my horse. It's saying it's time to go. It's saying it's time to go. Alright. Charles is leaving. I gotta go to Charles. Go. That just happened. I've been an army man my whole life. I heard them talking. They was gonna have you hanged for treason. You can't die for those fools. And what about the chief? We'll do it. What's some good looking turkey? I guess I won't be submitting my report. I wouldn't think so. <laughs> Right. 
Where are we going? I guess we're going here. Captain Monroe. I fear it may be Mr. Monroe from now on. I'm sorry about your career. Here. Oh, well. Here's some money. You take it and get out of here and start a new life somewhere. I hear Tahiti's nice. Thank <laughs> you. Just hop on a train to San Denis, jump on a boat, but avoid Guam. Where? Forget about it. Meet you back at camp. Mr. Morgan! <clears throat> oh, are you okay? Sister. Never better. What are you doing here? Well, I'm on my way down to Mexico. They're finally sending me on a mission. Huh. Brother Dorkins is very jealous. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? I'm uh, uh, knees. I'm done, Eesh. sister. Okay. Yeah, I got TB. I got it. Beating the man to death <clears throat> for a few bucks. <sighs> I've lived <laughs> bad. Time for another one, Arthur. Yep. We've all lived bad lives, Mr. Morgan. We all sin. But I know you. You don't know me. Forgive me, but that's the problem. You don't know you. What do you mean? I don't know, but whenever right you on to MK. meet you, you're always helping people and smiling. I'll try not to start shit that's till you uh, get back. He passed away. I had a girl who loved me. I threw that away. My mama died when I was a kid. And my daddy. Well, I watched him die. And it weren't soon enough. My husband died a long time ago. Life is full of pain. But there is also love and beauty. Uh, what am I going to do now? Be grateful that for the first time, you see your life clearly. Sure. Perhaps you could help somebody. Helping makes you really happy. <sighs> but I still don't believe in nothing. <laughs> Often neither do I. <laughs> but then I meet someone like you, and everything makes sense. You're too smart for me, sister. <laughs> I guess I... I'm afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of, Mr. Morgan. Take a gamble that love exists and do a loving act. All aboard! <laughs> Cowboy. <laughs> I shall try. I know you will. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. There's this homie. Okay. Well, here we are. Really, Heartland. Horses taking a dump. Nice. <clears throat> Let's do some feeding and some brushing.
down to the other side, do the same thing. Hey, come on, boy. Relax. Get on our horse. Save our game. Find out where we're going next. <coughs> so I think that we need to head over here. And that does not look like a bad way to do it, actually. There's a fort down here, so we'll try to avoid that best we can. Alright, so we can go over here. Is there anything in Emerald Station that I could need or want? I don't think so. So let's just go. What time is it? 7.52 p.m. We can camp here. For the night. Let's see. We'll sleep until morning, like we normally do. that like button if you haven't already I really would appreciate it we got 11 likes and 295 playbacks that's kind of uh, interesting numbers hey horse let's yep. go Take my time and enjoy the ride. Oh uh, yeah, you missed the highest. You you can join in on the next one, or even start another one. I'm sure they'll join in with you. You just have to look out for. Uh, Hostels here. I'm taking this path, probably not the greatest of ideas. I'm going to try to take a more direct route. You don't know who I am. <laughs> yeah, good boy. Why are we going up here again? When we're trying to get over there. You can probably cross right there. So 
Oh. Well, what if we do this? And then do this. Oh yeah, yeah, I imagine they would. You never finish the game. I just go out <clears throat> and get lost in the wilderness. This is going to be one of the most epic games I've ever completed. If not the most epic game I've ever completed. A turkey. in here. See, MK says, growing up around ranchers and mountain men, this game resonates a lot with my childhood and father did it again. <clears throat> a damn good job making this game realistic. This game has forced me to become not force me, this game has sparked my interest in American history and the settling of the West, so on and so forth. And that's really cool. I've looked up a couple and watched a few documentaries ah, on the subject is. since then. Old Black Lung Morgan. Shut up. Was you followed? Excuse me? Was you followed? Do you know who you're talking to? I ain't sure. I ain't sure about much no more. All I know is there's law whenever you're around. Is that so? Mm. Because it seems to me that since you've been riding with us, there ain't been nothing but trouble. Stirring things up all the time, getting in Dutch's ear. Seems wherever you is, there's Pinkertons and vice versa. So you better watch your goddamn mouth, boy! <laughs> or... <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy, cowboy. You're gonna do yourself a mischief where you're headed. Micah, shut it! He started it! Dutch says we is to go on with plans to create a diversion. We gotta get some explosives to blow up the bridge. Keep the army out of here a few days. I think it's a real bad idea. I don't think Dutch cares too much what you think. That's clear. We gotta confuse him one I'm last right, time. Then he and I will head to Blackwater, collect the money, and help everyone leave. He's got a boat lined up. Blackwater's a fool's errand. Everyone knows it. Even a greedy moron like you. It's Dutch's That's cool. choice, Arthur. That's cool. okay. You're just a senior gun, same as the rest of us. Only you ain't well. I'm fine. Then you'll do Dutch's bidding, which is robbing a stage that's coming from Annisburg full of explosives. Rob a stage. All we seem to ever do is rob a stage, you and me. Not me. You two. I got my own planning to do. You boys got this shit. Guess we have. Come on, Arthur. And Cowpoke. 
take it easy. You could do with a vacation, hmm? <coughs> All right, let's go. All right, let's go. See that easy. Let's go. On an ambush. Here we go. Wonderful. Have fun, boys. Thanks. Marcus says we should jump it as soon as it comes through Van Horn. So you're taking orders from him now? I'm taking orders from Dutch, same as always. A pair of them are becoming unhinged. You hear about Dutch killing Cornwall? Hey, hold up a second. Pinkerton patrol over there. Okay, I think we're clear. Let's head off. Anyway, you were saying? Well, that needed to be done. Right now? With the Pinkertons breathing down our necks? See? I'm starting to think that you've gone soft, Morgan. Okay. Let's hold up here. Okay. So, wagon will be coming from that way, down from Annisburg. And it'll take the two of us to stop it completely, or it'll never get done. So, I was thinking, you go <clears throat> play dead, and I'll take care of him. <laughs> no, I'm the better shot, and you, you're the better actor. No, you play dead, and I'll cover you. I got that. I got that. Oh, that's them coming now, I think. It'll be quite the show. I don't want to show. I just want to get it done. Where did he go? Where did he, uh, I was following the yellow dot. I followed the yellow dot. The yellow dot led me astray. Going this way. Confused. Oh, okay. Now I see what I'm supposed to do. Who do I need to shoot first? the next one out. You again? Ooh! That was good. Get up. Legit, like, had my heart racing. 
Still does. MK, holy cow, dude. Good rootin' tootin' shootin' galloping. Like. MK, bro. Bro, thank you so much, dude. You're amazing, my friend. Holy, holy goodness. I, 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 I'm like thrilled that, that you're so entertained. <laughs> I, I truly appreciate it. Um, I really do. Um, let's see. We have more smiley faces on... This is the board right here. You deserve way more than two little smiley faces here, bro. Like, I wish I had extra emotes or all that good stuff for you, man. Thank you so much, dude. Um, Hey, and you won the heist. There you go. You won the heist. All right, we got to get to this meeting point here. That's, that's the plan. Let's go. Oh, no. This never goes. <sighs> oh, this goes to plan. Oh, it doesn't. Give me a better gun here. Thank you. Got you. Where is it? Or go, 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 go. Solo? Oh no. Killing a bunch of folks so we can rob some dynamite, blow up a bridge. This make any sense to you? It's a distraction. So it ain't meant to make sense. But it should to us. Look, there's Mike up ahead. Great. Whoa! So, you got it? We got it. Yes, we got it. What's wrong, Arthur? Nothing at all, boss. John, go drive this over to Bacchus Bridge. Arthur. Get a hidden near there. He really does think Bill, he's in charge. you go on ahead. I need to speak with Arthur. Good work, son. Yeah. What's going on? Listen. There you go. I know we ain't always seen eye to eye, and... Uh, you find me irritating, and a threat, and I like to annoy you. But right now, I need better from you, Arthur. Okay, Micah, whatever you say. I ain't the bad guy you think I am, Arthur. But I am a survivor. Stick with me and you'll live. Oh, the bridge is probably a two-man job. You should probably go help Marston. Why don't you? Like I said, Dutch and I got planning to do for the train. There's a big picture here, Arthur. Trust me. Okay. One of these days, I'd kind of like to rewrite that, uh, <clears throat> that heist stuff. Make it into, like, a different game or something kind of similar to, well, just a different Come game. On, boy. 
Or an additional game, whatever. All right, so. How in the world are we gonna pull this off? I'm wanted down here. And it's the only thing to do. Except for going and meeting this stranger up here. Do we go and meet the stranger? Or do we go all the way down here to San Denis where I'm wanted? Back in Red Dead on online, me and your friends would post up in Blackwater and Rooftop Holdout. Oh. I remember in Red Dead when we'd have a posse of 12 from work and would run online servers. Oh, dude, that's awesome. Uh, let's go check out this random encounter. Yeah. Time is it? PM. Don't take events, but I don't. But I don't say be a bitch and just go for the mission. <laughs> Meet the danger head on. Yeah, I hear you. <laughs> that smiles at us all. All we can do is smile back. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. No, it could go either way, but I'm gonna do this. I, I kind of want to get the uh, the map expanded, you know. Try to do all the white dots before we complete the uh, the yellow one. <laughs> uh, I like. I never could get into Grand Theft Auto. Like, I played Quake 3 Arena like nobody's business. That was an awesome game. Yeah. It's really kind of cool now that, uh... Some biscuits. Maybe a chocolate bar. Oh yeah, I played Quake 3 like crazy. Loved that game. And uh... <clears throat> then... After that, I just never really found a game I could get into. Until now. Folks know who I am, but I don't like being around them too much. I'm going to take the more direct route. Cut through the, the wilderness over here. Whoa! I gotta find woods, like, kinda quick. I 
take it. You were young and back in my day. We played Grand Theft Auto by going to a friend's house and take turns passing around the controller. Yeah, I'm a bit of a boomer. All we need is each other. That's what you said. Uh, I'm old. You all right there? Who are you? Oh, it's okay, ma'am. I don't mean you no harm. <laughs> well, it makes no difference now if... If an outlaw or a wild animal doesn't get me starvation, well... <clears throat> we came out here from the city in search of a different life. Something... true, something... real. All this squandering and indulgence, we wanted to strip it away, to find something authentic. <laughs> what a pair of fools. What a pair of fools. Is there a train station or a town I can take you to? No, I can't give up now. He wouldn't want that. I, I can't have it. I'm going to do this for you, Cal. Well, I'll, um, I'll leave you to it. <laughs> Is there anything left for you to eat? Nothing. No, we didn't know the first thing about hunting. We couldn't even catch a darn mouse. If you need any poisonous berries, though, I'm a natural at finding those. Well, you ain't gonna last much longer out here if you don't know how to hunt. Come on, I'll show you. All right. Hey. Eh? But you better not try any funny business. You know, I may be weak, no. but I still know how to stand up for myself. Oh, I don't doubt it. Come on. Tell me, you ever skin an animal before? No, but then again, I haven't caught much of anything either. Well, you'll need to know how to do both if you're going to survive out here. I am all too aware. So where should we head for? Uh, let's try in the trees down there, near the river. What happened to your <coughs> husband, if you don't mind me asking? A bear got him. It was horrifying. He survived, but only for a couple of days. I, I buried him a week ago. Uh, I'm sorry. This was really his dream more than mine. I'd have hopped the next train back to Chicago if he'd said the word. But now, I, I don't know, it's hard to explain. I have to do this. I understand. Yes. This is a good spot. What are we looking for? Well, I think we should start with something small, don't you? I kill it, you skin it. Sound fair? Skin it? But I, I, I don't even... Have a knife with me. Well, don't worry, you won't need one. No. Take a look around. There. Look. A rabbit. Okay, stay quiet and still watch me. Oh. Oops. Oh. Got it. Oh. Good shot. Okay then. Go on. Time to get your hands dirty. How do I I mean, what do I do? Just hold the legs tight and pull the skin away quickly. Should come right off. <laughs> Quick pick me up games. You can't sit down for more than five hours anymore. Oh my. <laughs> it worked. That is all there is to it. You did good. I think I've seen enough blood for one day. <laughs> Do you mind if we head back now? Sure. 
<clears throat> you did good. I can't get over how big That's these rabbits are. For a few days. I think of rabbits as cute, small little things, and they're Thank you so much. bigger than cats, man. So I mean, a small dog sometimes. Really ain't such a bad spot. You got a good water source. It's remote, but you can survive here, all right. I have no doubt that one can survive here. Whether Charlotte Balfour can is a different matter entirely. You've probably lived your whole life in the outdoors. Oh, a lot of it, that's for sure. I barely left the city what before coming to here. Do with it? Uh -huh. the summers growing up at his grandparents' lodge. I've never been Maine. hunting. I get the impression they did more punting than hunting. I like shooting. I've right. never been hunting. And fishing. I love fishing. I just oh, never go. No, we're done for now. No, no we're not. Stay back. You smell the dead rabbit. Hey, just give me a uh, other. Get, 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 get off of me. Dead. Retry. Does that mean I lose my horse? Tell me I lost my horse. All right, this is my horse. This is Scarlet. All right. Okay, boy. Oh, we messed that up. So we can go and try this again. Since we're already here. Oh, John Marston's over here. We have a new mission. All right, well, since we're already here, let's go and teach the lady how to hunt again. some food. Food? I don't have any food. There we go. Big old rabbits, you. Yep. <laughs> what can I put down here? Um, I want that to be. This needs to be a knife. This needs to be. I prefer this to be a semi-auto shotgun. no difference now if, if an outlaw or a wild animal doesn't get me starvation well 
I guess that's where we get the stories of rabbit stew and stuff. We came out here from the city in search of a different life. Something true, something real. All this squandering and indulgence, we wanted to strip it away to find something authentic. Can I skip this? <laughs> What a pair of fools. Hey, I can. <clears throat> oh, permadeath mode? Oh, jeez. You ever skin an animal before? No, but then again, I haven't caught much of anything either. Well, you'll need to know how to do both if you're going to survive out here. I am all too aware. So where should we head for? Uh, let's try in the trees down there, near the river. What happened to your husband, if you don't mind me asking? A bear got him. It was horrifying. He survived, but only for a couple of days. I, I buried him a week ago. Uh, I'm sorry. This was really his dream more than mine. I'd have hopped the next train back to Chicago if he'd said the word. But now... I... Look, a rabbit! Right there. Yes, good eye. Okay, stay quiet and still. Watch me. Oh no, it's hopping away. Quick, get him! Okay, I'm watching. It's a horrible shot. Got it. Okay then, go on. Time to get your hands dirty. How do I... I mean... What do I do? Just hold the legs tight and pull the skin away quickly. Should come right off. <laughs> oh my! It worked. That's all there is to it. You did good. I More than gold. Seen enough blood for one day. Do you mind if we head back now? Come How on. you doing, bro? I'll walk you back. <clears throat> you did good. I'm gonna get a semi-auto shotgun that out for these wolves. For oh yes, at least. Thank you so much. I mean. Really ain't such a bad spot. You got a good water source. It's remote, but you can survive here all right. I have no doubt that one can survive here. Whether Charlotte Balfour can is a different matter entirely. You've probably lived your whole life in the outdoors. Oh, a lot of it, that's for sure. I barely left the city before coming here. Cal spent his summers growing up at his grandparents' lodge in Maine, but... I get the impression they did more punting than hunting. Right. Oh, oh, Lord. No. We're done for now. Wolf, stay back! Dead rabbit. You see, if, if if you hadn't been here, I, I'd be dead now. You got a rifle? Yes. Well, my my husband's. I suggest you learn how to use it. Now, come on, let's get you home. I'll need a poor wolf pelt. Since we got here, it feels like every step forward has come with a hundred steps back. People always talk about the simplicity of country life, but there's nothing. Maybe she can eat it. Oh no. Uh, I guess we only know what we know. Oh please, I'm sure it wouldn't take you too long to adjust to a life of privilege and indolence in the big city. I don't know about that. It sounds off. Oh, it is. A truly empty and boring existence. But an undeniably easy one. I still can't believe he's gone. Where's she going? Hmm. 
A lot of fat, yeah it is. Thank you. That was the first time anyone's done anything nice for us. For me, since we got here. Well, nature provides, but she sure don't always make it easy. That she doesn't. I'd invite you in, but I'm dead on my feet, if you'll forgive the pun. <laughs> Please do call again sometime, though. A good rest, and hopefully I'll be a new woman. You take care, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> Uncooked bacon, huh? Well, have a good night. Okay. <clears throat> Bounty now. Ooh. I've got a bounty. Lots of places, looks like. So I need to fast travel down to. Riggs Station. Okay. So I need rig station. If you get uncured bacon, it just means it's cured naturally and is usually better quality and safer than normal grocery store stuff. Oh, yeah. Less uh, preservatives and whatnot. Well, no preservatives. I'm a fan of like smoking meat and stuff. I just don't get to do it nearly enough. I need to go to and it won't let me travel to rigs. So I need to travel to the next place. Hamish? Oh yeah, the fishing. Bacchus Station. So I need to go to Valentine, basically. No, I need to go to Strawberry. I also need to go pee.
Alright. Out o town. That's where we need to go. Let's see if we can get some food while we're at it here. Yeah. Yep. Awesome sauce. <laughs> made this ride more than once to go pay a bounty. Also, you know, speaking of pork, I like my pork chops cooked to a nice medium. I don't like them to be cooked to death. I also like my bacon, uh, like, I don't know, just the amount, or just the right amount of crispy. Like, most people would say I like floppy bacon. I do. I like floppy bacon. Hard to get good quality stuff from store or best from a butcher. Well, that's always the point. If you cook all the fat off, or to get the calories from the fat, you can see that. We shop at uh, Whole Foods, not Whole Foods, um, Fresh Market. A lot. We buy a lot of our meat from Fresh Market, and uh, if we don't get it from Fresh Market. We usually get it from Whole Food or someplace. But I uh, hate. Kroger with a passion will not shop at Kroger unless it's like absolutely necessary. Do I have any mail to pick up? You leave something behind? Yeah, do I? No, I have any time. Thanks, partner. All right, boy. Realistically, in an outdoor survivor situation, you can eat raw meat and even rotten meat. When it comes to the hunger, the body can handle it just fine. Yeah, as long as it's fresh enough, yeah, you're right. Meat, unless, like, the whole thing with pork, you know, that was just because it was uh, contaminated with trichinosis or whatever it is, the, the worms. But they haven't seen any of those in, like, decades. Um, <clears throat> and then... Uh, do we go see John or Sadie? I really don't want to mess around in sand and knee. I really don't. But all I'd have to do is go that way. Go in there. I'm already over here. All right, I'm gonna fast travel to. I'm gonna travel to Rhodes, and yeah, I'm gonna travel to Rhodes, and we're gonna do it. We're gonna do this thing. Morning, to you, amigo. Morning. Hey there, Mister. All right, we're gonna go to Rhodes, and we're gonna do this thing. Um, I wouldn't buy a rotten steak, especially one pumped with hormones. But actually, wild game meat's a different story. Very true. <clears throat> Very true. Um. Yeah, the whole purpose, you know, really of cooking the meat is to kill the surface bacteria and to have the Maillard reaction and add your flavor and whatnot. Um. I, I've cooked once or twice in my life, uh, professionally and just to have fun. I love cooking. It's, uh, I don't do it enough. Uh, 
If I had the kitchen, I would do a cooking show, but my kitchen is not, uh, not, uh, very conducive to filming, I suppose. So from here, we need to come down here. That's our waypoint. Road to roads on the country roads with a road. See, road right here. Road. <laughs> That's, <funny. laughs> That's mighty funny. I wonder if I need anything. I'm gonna get some bullets first. I want to get some bullets here. Hopefully. Hey, partner. Hello. Back again? Yes, I am. What can I offer you? You okay, let me see. creepy piece of something, man. Buy all of your ammo munition here. Try this. Psst. Oh boy. Thanks, you are. Hello. <clears throat> All right, here we go. Gavin? Gavin, they're looking for Gavin again. You look for legit organic stuff makes a world of difference. I overpaid so much for organic chicken and oh my god, so juicy and full of flavor. That's the one yeah. thing about the fresh market. Like, I don't typically buy organic things, but their quality of meat is so much better. Like, I sometimes I splurge. I buy the prime stuff every now and then. Like, if it's just going to be me, and I planned on spending 40 bucks on two, or dinner for two, and it's just going to be me, then yeah, I'll, I'll spend the money on a nice, a nice piece of meat. Um, but, um, uh, hey, hey, I don't want to race you. I do not want to race you. No. No, no. 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 You grass-fed. Lady, I don't oh, have no, time right thanks. now. All right, suit yourself. Thanks. But yeah, I like uh, <clears throat> I'll buy a steak. All right, so yeah. now that we're here. We need to evaluate our plan of action. Good butter is good butter. All right, I'm going to ride to right here. But I'm going to do the railroad tracks. with you. Alright, boy. Alright, let's cross right here. Oh, I'm hot. Alright. Horse. Alright, 
uh, here I am. Well, hello, new subscriber. Nice to meet you. Hello. Alright, that's a gator. And... I need to... Get on the railroad tracks and cross. Idiot. If I got some butter, I would buy some good steak and use it. Yeah, man. I'm in wanted territory here. I'm not going to mess with them. Rainbow. Buy tags and hunt buffalo. Yeah. Alright, we're still wanted here. We are in San Anito. How far away from Sadie are we? So we kind of need to stick along the outskirts of town. Alright, so we're just going to stick to the docks here. Kind of. nobody will recognize us. Just blend in nicely. <clears throat> I don't need to be on the train. In fact, I don't want to be on the train. I want to be quite far away from all of y'all here. Oh! Oh, other way. Get in there. Nothing, 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 nothing. Don't cause a scene. Or I still need to go way around. What am I doing? I'm sorry. Can't go that way, so I am gonna have to cut through here and hopefully not get seen. Hey. have to cut around here Following the train track around. It's 
sounds weird, but I'm doing it this way. I warned you. What? I don't want your train. I don't want your train. I just want to see where I need to be. A little bit further up the tracks. Oh. It says I'm still hot. Why? Sadie in here. Yes, I have to go straight up that street and into the thing. Same thing. You've had to deal with that. But first, thank you for your service, man. Cross the road. Danny's been hanging out over in the lottery channel. That's cool. Hope she's having a great time. Lots of nice people over there. so riled up. Today is a great day, Arthur. Today is the day they are going to hang Colm O'Driscoll. Uh, so, Please. rather they hang him or I shoot him. Oh, they are going to hang him. You guys are awesome. Thanks for staying, with, staying up with me this late, y'all. That boy's been on the gallows more than most. I wouldn't count anything until his neck's broke. Well, nor would I. Which is why, despite us being wanted men, we're gonna attend the event ourselves. And follow him onto the scaffold? Well, let's hope not. But if I could see that son of a bitch breathe his last, I think I'd die a happy man. We are gonna disguise ourselves. In this? In this. <laughs> I'm with him. I'm with him. Like, what? Okay. Come on. All right. Well, don't we just look the part? We'll cut through the alley to get to the gallows. We keep our weapons holstered, our disguises on, and our wits about us. Mrs. Adler, might I say, being a fancy woman of Saint Denis shoots you. <laughs> I dress up like the Queen of Sheba if it meant seeing that son of a bitch swing. Colm hung me up. Nearly butchered me. I don't mean I'm comfortable in this woolen coat. You made it out of that predicament, as I remember, Mr. Morgan. My husband weren't so lucky. You lost your husband. I lost my darling Annabelle. That poor boy, Kieran. We've all lost something because of COVID. <laughs> and that is like why it's crazy. We yes. him to eternity. Very crazy. Into that. Keep those fingers off those triggers, because we'll need cool heads and calm dispositions to see this done. <laughs> Practice what you preach, brother. Whatever do you mean? Are you going to keep your cool? Really? When you seem to lose it all so often now. This doubting and questioning of yours? I miss the old Arthur. 
don't we all? You two quit it. Oh, y'all got well. a job to do, and we're all in rough agreement about how we're doing it. As far as I can tell. Exactly. We'll get it done, all right. All right then. Come on. We got a hanging to witness. Mike did all the talking. How's this gonna go? Don't the public <clears throat> love an execution? <clears throat> Won't the other the other cops not know that we're not like real? I don't know. But. Hey. All right. Good. Now, you see that pair of assholes? Sure. They're Combs boys. Yes, I think so. What a surprise. I'm glad we're here. What are they pointing at? I don't know. We gotta follow them and find out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, here comes somebody. <clears throat> Stay here. Don't do nothing. All right, where are we going? Go brush that horse, officer. Yes, sir. Nah. The crowd came to see a show. We don't want to disappoint them. I guess they did miss their chance to see John swing by his neck. Hey, hey. You know I wasn't going to let it come to that. Well, I guess I don't know what I know no more. And I guess this isn't the time to question either my decisions or yours. Here and now, Combe O'Driscoll's going to get his due. He's cutting in there. Let's go, quiet. Yo, what's up, dude? 25 months holy cow thank you so much joe welcome to the stream bro jj general one arcade is here 24 month member 25 month cal so they got a guy up on the roof overlooking the gallows find a way up there on one of these verandas through a building maybe and get him and do it silently well, obviously, I'm going to do it silently. I want to see this bastard swing. Oh, Arthur. Here's a ladder. Hey, I think I'm going to use it. Find a way up to the roof and stop him. I'll go back to Mrs. Adler. Hmm. Way up to the roof. Ooh, I don't need there. Oh, yeah. Right up here. Approach the shooter's location. Oh boy. So I probably need to go out here. Can I open that window? No. This window is open though. Okay. Now we get to go up over here. Joe, I'll get your name on the board just right now, actually. Where are we? JJ General One in the purple because that's your channel color. Unless you want something different. Drop right, say hi, you got to go to bed. <laughs> oh man, well it's good seeing you. I hope you had a wonderful evening Ubering. JJ. General One. Thank you so much, bro. There we go, JJ General One. I'll rewrite that later when my hand is better writing condition
Um, told Danielle if you win money on the giveaway, I donate money to get her a channel coin. Oh, that's cool. What? Whose channel? Colm O'Driscoll is one such man. He has murdered, tortured, robbed, stolen, raped, and abused for a decade across oh, five cool. states seemingly with impunity. Today, justice catches up with him. <laughs> As well you may. I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges This are... is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Cole Modriscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. This is not a task we take lightly. It is not a task we enjoy. But it is a task we must carry out. See, Joe, thank you so much, bro. Have a good rest, man. Gentlemen, are we ready? Call Modrisco. May God, in his infinite wisdom, have mercy upon your soul. Whenever you are ready. <laughs> now you know how it feels to watch somebody you love die. You ruined my life! Woo! Morgan! You hear us? Take a shot on these old Driscolls! Uh... Oh, you? Already finished this game oh. twice. Oh, nice! This is my first, uh, my first uh, playthrough. Yo, what's up from India? Hey, much love, man. Nice to see you. Yeah, nice to meet everybody. Hope y'all are having a great time tonight, this morning, whatever the case may be. Smash that like button if you haven't already. I really do appreciate it. This is my first playthrough of the game, and I'm having a blast with it. I'm absolutely loving it. 
All right. Let's go. Well, we saw the bastard hang okay, but... You know, I pretty much well, agree with you. <laughs> pretty much agree with you. I guess that's the best thing to worry about. I hope I'm not butchering your name. Yeah, I'm so sorry if I am. The entire government, in the end, Como Driscoll didn't seem like such a worry. A letter came for you. Oh, okay. I know it's from that Mary. Mary? She ain't worth it, Arthur. Who is? <laughs> My dear Arthur, you never showed up. And now, after looking at the newspapers, I understand why. I don't imagine you'll receive this letter, but I nonetheless must send it. Arthur. Oh, Arthur. I was just starting to dream the silliest and softest of dreams. I miss you, and I will always miss you. But I cannot live like that. And it seems you cannot live any other way. When I'm with you, the world makes sense. But when we are apart, <clears throat> I see clearly that your world is not a world from which one can escape. I'm so sorry for everything. For everything oh, long cool. ago and for starting up that business again. Thank you, Ange. There's a good man within you. They're all still public. Just uh, scroll down but to the bottom and save all the live streams. The giant. And the giant wins time and again. You've broken my heart again. And I fear I have broken yours. I'm going to make a Red Dead playlist Dad, eventually and have I will it all. I'll never forgive you myself, know. but you must let me go now. I enclose a ring you gave me many years ago when we were both young. Not because I don't like it, but because I care for it far too much, and it reminds me too much of you. I hope one day you will find some people in love who can use this, for it kept me thinking of you all these years, and I hope by returning it to you, I can finally be free. Goodbye, Mary. Deuces, Mary. Goodbye. See you later. <sighs> Let's go. Is there anything on the back? No, nah, just some dirt. Let's put it that way. I just wanted to continue playing, but got stuck watching me. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, you know, I I truly appreciate it, y'all. It's uh, it's really a, a cool thing that that. I mean, number one, y'all, y'all like sticking around. I mean, that's just, that's just amazing, man. Uh, yeah. give her up, Arthur. <laughs> what should we do here? How you doing? We we'll just go around and talk hey, to people for a second. Hello, Arthur. Hello. We got the kid over there. What are our mission objectives in life right now? What does we has to do? Hey, we can actually leave the wanted dead or alive area of the world. Very nice. We're going to pick up the HS side mission. That is fishing with Hamish Sinclair. All right. So... <clears throat> We need to go buy some food, I think. Let's check on our supplies. Let's do that. Let's check our supplies. Food-wise, we've got cooked big game meat. All right, we got some cigars and crap. We got some mushrooms and crap. All right. I mean, we're, we're somewhat okay on food here. Not great, but we're... We're good enough. We can shoot something in the wild. I would like to have some canned goods, though. Wouldn't mind going to a city and buying some canned goods. Um, Lego might be coming out with a Seven Dwarves Lego model kit. Ooh, that's awesome. 
Uh, for those of you that also don't know, uh, I do play Beat Saber on Tuesday nights. I'm from the United States, so Tuesday nights at around 8.30 or so Central Standard Time, um, give or take an hour or two, um, I play Beat Saber on there every single Tuesday night as long as I can help it, and sometimes throughout the course of the week, such as yesterday morning at 6 a or 8 a.m. <laughs> but yeah, I, I love Beat Saber. Uh, it, it's like... It's in my top three games right now are Quake Three Arena, Beat Saber, Red Dead Redemption Two. Like that's that's it. I'm I'm pleased with that. Um, we need to do what? Well, I was checking my satchel. I need to get some canned goods. So I really don't need to go fishing right now. So that means we go to see Eagle. To take action against the military. That sounds bad. Yeah. Then we got John. So, blow the bridge using explosives we stole with Bill. I, I think we need to take care of John's mission first. I saw in your about section, you do Legos. Your 12-year-old son did a really good job in math and science. So I spent the hard-earned money to get him the Lego Bugatti. Dude, that kid's awesome. That kid's... Freaking amazing. Yeah, dude. I, I like Legos. Uh, I do. I got um, <laughs> lots of them. <laughs> Mostly within the past year. Uh, I bought most of my collection, but I absolutely love them. Um, I'm in the process of putting a, a Disney castle together right now, and I still have some repairs to do on it. I, I flubbed something up. So, uh, oops. Um, is there a faster way to get there other than riding on our horse, horse, horse? Doesn't look like it. We're going to have to ride, y'all. We're going to have to ride. I'm going to try to take a more direct path if I can, but uh, I don't know if we can cross this river right here. All right, we're going to take the river crossing. Eesh. I could go straight across. Let's see what we encounter. Arthur Morgan. What do you want, drunk lady? I'm mad at your mom for giving away my Legos when I was a teenager. Between my kids and your rarity, I would have kept them to stay almost 40. Uh, yeah, I'm almost 40. Um, Go to hell. Well, I guess it's true what they say. You can't take it with you. But Herr Strauss, I thought you liked helping the weak and unfortunate. You're unfortunate. I don't like helping you. <laughs> Very amusing. Just try I try to do Legos on Thursdays. For us. <clears throat> Some of us are trying to save folk, not make unnecessary dramas. All right. Boy. Yeah. I'm 38. Hey. Well. Wrong with you. Back here. Easy there. What is this horse's problem? Here. Settle down, girl. Easy. It's okay. We gotta get you back over here to the hitching post. Why did my... My help, my good bad rating went down. That's weird. Anyway. The nano, oh dude, yeah. And it was fun. I hadn't messed with either one of them. I try to do it on Thursdays, like I said, but it's been rough here lately. My brain just hasn't been in let's do Lego mode. Let's see up. But when it gets back into let's do Lego mode, I'll I'll do Lego. Glad to see the chat popping. It's 4 a.m. I talk a lot, but that's attention-seeking, just socialism. Hey, man, yeah, 
what that's what this is for, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, smoke back five minutes or so. Sounds like a plan. Enjoy. Let's just go ahead and feed the horse. Yep. Yo, MK, brother man. Holy goodness gracious. Wow, oh wow. Let's keep the chat popping. Like that smash button and sub if you haven't already. Keep the commu our great community here. MK brother, brother man, holy goodness gracious. You know, we might have to schedule some kind of like massive live stream event real soon, maybe. I'm not sure, but um people been talking about like a twenty four hour stream. I'm not I'm not sure if I would quite want to go into the twenty four hour streaming, but uh, I don't know. I might do like a scheduled twelve hour stream or something like that. I'm not real sure. We can figure that out. But holy goodness gracious, appreciate it again. Um, MK, more happy faces, underlines and stuff. Honestly, supporters for you. I might change your name, but hey, right on, right on. Have we crossed paths in before? I'm curious because I used to know and I used to know a guy with the initials MK. Uh, that had some really interesting streams. Um, and uh, if that's you, hello. If it's not, then it's still great to meet you. I mean, um, I'm 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 loving this game, and I'm happy that the community here. Nope. Okay. Cool. Cool. Um, that's uh, that's cool. So yeah, the uh. <clears throat> I'm I'm so happy that the community here is oh oh I ain't messing with that is uh just liking this game as much as I'm as I am it's uh he <laughs> thought that Ducky was here I can bring the Ducky's face onto the screen you know that <laughs> yeah Ducky hadn't sent me what's for dinner yet Ducky what's wrong with you buddy you need to send me what's for dinner. hold off on these guys here um oh, did, uh, what am I doing what am I talking about I don't know yeah the community in the game um this community as you've noticed by now we're mostly I'm gonna say like older individuals but we're we're, you know, all between 25 and 40, most of us. Most of us on the above, above 30 range. Well, some of us anyway. But yeah, it's a, it's a nice community. Um, most of us, again, we know, we have a lot of varied interests. Um, God, the story of this channel, it's crazy. Right on, man. Enjoy, for real, enjoy. I'll tell stories later. I'll ride horse for right now. <laughs> I will ride horse now. Tell stories later. Man, these mountains, though. Let's just chill okay. here for a second. I want to go look at these mountains. Enjoy the sight here. The horse is going to take a dump. That's great. Whoopsies. Right, that's good enough.
It looks like I can just wind my way down through here. Hey, there's some fishing folks. Hey. So, Bean, what you been up to, man? I found out what Dad got. Dad got a six-piece uh, M18. Uh, tool set. And, uh, he also got me and him a, uh, M18 4 amp hour battery kit with charger. So that's kind of new and interesting. I haven't seen the fours before, so I'm excited about that. He didn't get me a toolkit, but he got me uh, two of the uh, four mil four amp hour batteries, and also he got me the uh, D jig saw. So I'm super excited about the D jig saw as well. So now I've got my impact driver. I've got my jigsaw. I will have my jigsaw, my batteries. Uh, and then I will be well yeah. on my way to being able to construct anything that I would like to construct out of wood. So I can just start building up my Milwaukee tool collection after that as needed. I'm super excited. I don't know what the first thing I'm going to build is. No idea. Ducky needs to be putting in the corner. For not letting me know what's for dinner. Ah, oh, that ducky. These turkeys, though. These turkeys, though. The wild turkeys. Uh. Oh, my check. Time is at 7.54. About time to sleep it off for the night. All that. That sound like a coyote. That does not sound good. Will it let us sleep until the morning? Eight hours. Some wolves out here. I hope they don't do nothing stupid. This doesn't look good. In the middle of the night. Alright, it did turn morning. Thank goodness. Tear down the camp. Come on, boy. Yeah. Here we go. We need some food. Probably. What's my health at now? Actually, yeah, we're okay. We're okay. I haven't been doing much finishing up staining cedar ornaments. Oh yeah. Like what? Like Christmas ornaments? What the hell are you Pretty neat. John? Arthur, how you doing? Nervous? But I've been nervous for a wait on MK to come back before we continue this. I'm sure he'll want to see it. Holy goodness gracious, let's take a stretch break or something, man. Oh I need a stretch break.
Oh, you're back. Right on. Cool. For sure, for, all right. Oh, I've been thinking. I can get one of those, uh, um, I don't know, Christmas work, that's cool, man, I'm gonna have to hit you up for one of those, man, uh, I'd like to buy one of those from you, um, so the, uh, yeah, I was thinking I could get one of those pneumatic, maybe not pneumatic, but one of those arms that hold the monitor up, because right now I just have monitor trees, with uh, fixed arms, they'll tilt and they'll come in and out. But if I could get one that raised up and down easily, then I could put big monitor on this side, and, or even where it's at, and then I could raise it up along with my camera and be able to play a video game standing up like this. And it would do wonders for my back. It's a shit ton less expensive than a standing desk which I know for a fact I would not use so I might look into those options I've been talking about buying one for a long time I just never never really thought about it um but with this Red Dead game that's that's an option they're not they're not terribly expensive I'll probably I'm gonna get on Amazon later on monitor arms are amazing but yeah mine don't go up and down unless I use a wrench yep that's the ones that I have the pile or whatever it is Nope. I had a lot of time to think in that jail, and I feel like I just don't know Dutch no more. You ain't the only one. And this plan to get us out, it just feels... I don't know. Like he's stringing us along, I know. Killing in cold blood, revenge, we all do bad things, but he seems to enjoy it now. It's like he just wants to create more enemies, more chaos. Yeah, I know. I mean, I love Dutch. He saved me a long time ago. I feel like in San Denis, when I got arrested, maybe he could have done something. I feel like you should take your woman and child and get lost. Do you? You can... You could give something to Jack. Hey, Stider. Well, I don't see no way out of this. Well, what about loyalty? Be loyal to what matters. <clears throat> what are you gonna do? I'll be okay, but do it for me. It would make me feel good, if that makes any sense. A little, but... Listen to me. When the time comes, you gotta run and don't look back. Ian, that's, that's very kind this of you. Just, just let me know, man. I'll, or, or, I'd like to compensate you somehow. Now we gotta help Dutch give the army one <coughs> final tweak on his nose. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Help me with the rest of this. I think I got some stickers left over or something. I think I still do. I can get some more printed. Some of them holographic ones. Really nice stickers. Hold down. Let's ride this thing out onto the bridge. There's a spot about a third of the way across where we can get down underneath to plant the charges. I've already set up the detonator. Sure, let's get this over with. Did you hear about Dutch and Cornwall? Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. More enemies, more chaos. I mean, we're about to blow up a bridge for Christ's sake. All right, stop. Here's good. <sighs> we sure got a lot of this stuff. We'll need it. I'll climb down there, you lower the crates. Alright, yeah. let me know when you're ready. Oh, coke collect, Kathy, yeah. Ready when you are. 
I'm at the bottom of the ladder here to your left. There's good. Lower it down. I'm ready. Come on. All right, take it slow. That's not something we want to drop. That's it. Nearly there. Okay, good. Grab the other one. Rust Rock Cat. Hello! Welcome! Boom! Man, it's about to happen. Just drop the bombs on his head. <laughs> Just like last Hello, Come good on. morning, evening, whatever this is to you. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a great day. Okay, buddy. Wired to the detonator. We need to attach each of those bundles to the fuses. There's one on each of the main support beams. Okay. I sure hope this is enough to blow it. These are mine in charge. They ain't easy to come by. If they don't do the job, nothing will. Man, we're about to blow up a bridge. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> This is crazy. Now I need pack out boxes to protect them. I'll get those as I get the tools, hopefully. Those boxes are so freaking expensive, man. Worth it, I'm sure, but geez, they're expensive. Okay. I should go get the hand cart oh, ready. You one. okay to finish off down here? Sure. Go on. I can handle the rest. I'll see you up there. Alright, one more bundle. We're about to go boom, folks. Smash that like button if you're ready to see it go boom. <laughs> That'll be awesome. That waterfall's so beautiful. There was an incident in Arizona back in the day. A few boys decided to use an old mining shaft as target practice. It was filled with TNT. Let's just say the story is all that's left. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, the song. Wait a minute. Did I actually leave this going? No, I did not. All right, cool. <laughs> I was like, is that my music or not the game? <laughs> um, man. I'd love to go out and shoot some Tannerite one day. Just because. Uh, well, you, sir. Let's go. Got it. Thank you. No problem. That just ain't how I want to die. Come on. Let's go blow this thing up. <clears throat> My guy won't whistle. held you want the honors sure yes I do <laughs> yes I do all right here we go
five, four, three, two, one. I guess old Dutch got all the smoke he wants. Let's hope so. You really think that that'll draw attention away from us? I guess we'll see. Tell the truth, I ain't even sure I fully understand Dutch's plan with all this. Like I said, John, when the time comes, you go. What about loyalty to, to everything? You've been loyal. I've been loyal. Look what that caused. You know, all that ever mattered to me was loyalty. It's all I knew. It's all I ever believed in. Well, not anymore, John. Soon, you gotta go. Go. But don't look back. Oh, wow, nice, B. I'll think about it. I've done a lot of the hill. <laughs> yeah. Look at us. Out here risking our necks and for what exactly? For an idea that don't work no more. How you mean? You know just what I mean. You got a family. You need cash. You need to start building a life for yourself. Me? I need a vacation. <laughs> and Dutch has all the money. For safekeeping. You know something? Abigail thinks she might know where some of that money is. Well, you tell her she better make sure. And then come talk to me. And we'll find out just who and what we should be loyal to. I don't know, Arthur. Nor do I. But I'm seeing things a lot more clearly now. I wish things were different. But it weren't us who changed. Yeah! Ah, oh, Django. Man, that movie. Oof, that movie. I mean, it's a stellar movie. When they were talking about gilding earlier in the game, that's what I thought about. That's what I thought about was uh, was the Django scene. I guess I can't buy a train ticket. <laughs> okay, boy. So where are we going from here? We've got Eagle action against the military. And then we've got Sadie. <clears throat> Anybody else? Nope. Action against the military or Sadie. Um, you watched The Hateful Eight the other day, and Wow is a very good movie. It's it is play style like back in the day when movies used to be stories and not just effects. I highly recommend watching that movie. It's kind of gruesome though, as it's a Tarantino movie. Hey, bro, gruesome is my gig, man. I'm I'm a haunted house actor and uh, uh, amongst other things at the haunted house. I live Halloween all year round. Um, my entire uh, oh, the bridge has an X now. Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, I live Halloween year round. Like I'm working on projects for this upcoming season right now. Well, not right now. I'm actually thinking of it right now, but um, that's part of working on it. 
But yeah, this uh, this thing behind me that's uh, holding the corn is actually a uh, piece of a costume that I bought from a haunted house um, that um, um, I acquired. But yeah, it's uh, from a really cool thing. I've got a two-headed baby sitting over here. I've got... Uh, I own one, two whole straight jacket outfits with both shirt, like the straight jacket itself and the pants. Um, both of them goried up, and neither one of them have the cuffs and the uh, the um things on them. I I cut them out. One of them I had tailor made just for me. The other one, I cut the uh the straps off of it and made cuffs at the end, and I bloodied them up and all that stuff um you know we we do some pretty cool uh pretty cool stuff i'll bring a piece of it in here um a piece of the cuff i bloodied up so i can show you but uh yeah i do all that kind of stuff i act um i uh i help uh i help run a major fundraiser here in the city every single year and it's it's the haunted house it's you know it's it's not a little haunted house. Um, what do you say? I have friends who ran a haunted house. They called it the slaughterhouse, and it was actually staged inside an actual slaughterhouse. Nice. The smell of the dried blood was a game changer. Nice, nice. Yeah, we've got a uh, a really big warehouse. We keep the space year round. We're always adding to it. It looks very much like uh, like a compound you might find out like in the walking dead or something man we've got uh, shipping containers and all kinds of fun stuff out there uh i <laughs> make the joke uh, uh i spent one afternoon um one afternoon with my face in the uh a zombie's ass or a demon's ass it was kind of interesting kind of funny we had to move a big animatronic prop Let's see if i can find a decent picture of the thing here, I can kind of show it to you. I know we're, we're supposed to be playing the video game. But, you know what, I'll, I'll load some pictures onto the stream uh, the next time, and I can show you all, show you some pictures of the haunted house. also got a, uh, um, <clears throat> uh, where are we going? also have a, let's go back over here. Um, train of thought just got derailed. All of the pun intended. Let's go. All of the pun intended, indeed. Yep. Let's go out here and camp. Let's go out here and brush our horse. Well, no, let's let's camp. Then we'll brush our horse. Um. They had the zombie course where you used air rifles with lasers to shoot zombies with your military experience. You put a coin on your show for the zombies, or you had to go pro back then. <laughs> nice. Uh, I helped run a zombie paintball event one year. Um, that was interesting. I was on charge of a two-ton. I was on top of a two-ton, and we had uh, 12 air, uh, 12 paintball guns on either side, all controlled by me. I, I had air supply on the top and we had this whole course laid out we go down a hill around this thing we had a whole village set up a big uh facade um i mean it was just it was really cool man you go like and when the fog rolled in like it would be warmer up here up and like cooler down inside the uh the ditch so or the basin so we'd go down through the fog and we had the zombies out there and shoot paintballs at them and yeah it was it was a great time um as far as haunted houses go man i've been a hillbilly i've been a big ass like bird i've climbed up on top of stuff um Um, if you do the Sadie mission, go to the Hanging Dog Ranch with her just before you kill the O'Driscolls. Look back at where you were sleeping, and you can pick up a free Litchfield Repeater. Ooh, okay. Are you in NorCal or SoCal? Either way, it'd be fun as heck to come down. Ah, uh, nah, dude, I'm in Memphis. Still, come on down. Look up Wicked Ways Haunted House. I don't, I don't mind putting that out there. I work with Wicked Ways Haunted House. <laughs> In fact, I have uh, Wicked Ways Haunted House on my uh, um, on my most viewed videos. It's like number five or six now, I think. It's a little behind the scenes thing. 
nothing special too much but i mean it is inside the haunted house <laughs> um what am i doing let's hope for a better day i was coming back here because it was closer to something let me brush my horse that's a great idea let me let me brush you then we'll go and do something else here uh brush 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 In fact, this hat right here, I bought for a uh, Halloween costume for the haunted house. It was kind of funny. We, uh, me and, uh, <clears throat> well, first off, it was Chase. You know, Chase in the chat, uh, he, he's the IRL friend of mine, Chase and Maddie. Um, yo, what up, Game Tamer? How you doing, bro? Uh, so, yeah, Chase and Maddie, they also, um, they're big, uh, big haunted house people. We all work together up there. And, um, me, well, Chase started wearing the, the jacket, like, Chase started wearing the jacket. And I went out, he, when we all dressed as Chase for Halloween. So I went out, I got a jacket. I bloodied it up. It looks better in person than it does on this camera. It's it's decent stage blood. It's not that crap. But anywho, um, bought the jacket, bought the hat at Tractor Supply, and there was three of us running around um, dressed as Chase. It was pretty amazing. Um, every come to your haunted house you scared the crap out of me you need new pants you know we have we have truly scared people to the point where they have wet themselves we've scared people to the point where they have pooped their pants um i've seen more than one person um i've seen more than one person like they'll they'll like pass out or something like i don't know what's up with them but they uh they'll they'll like collapse it's 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 nutty um one time i scared a group of people so bad <laughs> happened to be a football team happened to be a college football team and they got scared so bad that they went into a wall that was anchored onto the concrete floor and they shifted the wall like they broke the room it was kind of kind of crazy <laughs> Unrational things. Who keeps the bloody jet, dude? <laughs> Welcome to the stream, bro. <laughs> I need someone to ride with me. Do what? Finish off them of the preschools. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. I don't have it in me no more. I saw Colm swing. I, I just don't care. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me. And to my husband? But you're the only one of these fools that I trust. I've got to do this. <laughs> I got thought about it. <laughs> yes, we'll help Sadie. Of course, we'll help Sadie. We always help Sadie. Yeah, this with a butcher jacket and a silicone mask. He wonders with it. Abigail, Jack, John, make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But when the time comes. But how do you mean? When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? I mean, help them escape when I... <laughs> you know, you and me, we're more ghosts than people. But them, they, they could... I know. Of course I will. Thank you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now or meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can? Well, let's go with Sadie. Thanks, Arthur. 
Okay. Come on. Hello, how are you? Won't you tell me your name? Hello, how are you? Let's go hunt some wild game. There's that elk again. That legendary... Uh, and is that an elk? No, that's a deer. It's a deer this time. It's showing me all of the legendary animals that I'm supposed to hunt. I see. Find more for killing. Hey. A buck. You seen Thank anything you. down there? Yeah, I think there's a bunch of them down there. <clears throat> I'm mostly drunk. For one of them, it's a fat fellow with a beard. Him? He's mine. Okay. Dreaming of the grace. Oh. It's a big ranch, run down, lots of folk there, but spread pretty thin. I'll set it off, and then we'll we'll take it from there. Take it from there. Okay. So, no real plan then. Oh, I got a plan. Now come on. Is that a woman? Jesus. Who the hell is that lady? Hey, that's the lady from the hanging. Oh gosh. Sharpshooter in the hayloft. Got him. Do I not have any other weapons here? Gosh, I should have grabbed something off the uh, off the whatever there. There's a bunch of them. That was right in his face, bro. Sorry, isn't dead eye. Oh shoot! What? 
What happened? What happened? We killed everybody. Is that a woman? That's okay. Jesus. We'll do this what again. Get down. Oh. <laughs> nice. Stuff work. All right, good. Where are you? Where are you? Upstairs, go, go, fool. Ooh. <clears throat> what a 
happened, Dale? Okay. He's talking about you. Yeah. He was a good man, my Jakey. We was always sweet on one another. I'm sure. Yeah. I miss him every day, every moment. Uh, they turned me into a Crazy monster, Arthur. Yes, it was. Damn. But my memories of him. All right, camera break time, stretch time. They still pure. Mm. I ain't even got that. Let it out, y'all. Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. I know the company you keep. The competition ain't too fierce. <laughs> we, uh, we should get away from her. Yeah. I think I need to be alone for a bit. I understand. You, uh, might want to get yourself cleaned up. Thank you, Arthur. <sighs> <coughs> All right. Yeah, definitely would not want to piss her off. Definitely, definitely not. All right, here we go. MK, if you can learn how to play, I recommend a game called Examina. Some awesome physical combat I think you might like. Examina. Let me put it on my list of things here. Game two, try, examine, all right, examine, some awesome physics combat, cool, Litchfield from Minicamp, gotcha, all right, Litchfield from Minicamp, done that, done that, all right, Dungeon Crawler, 10 years yet to become an RPG, if I make a new channel, Oh, cool. Sounds fun. Check it out. I'll look it up. Um, I'll look it up for sure. Alright, we've done all this stuff. I don't need that. Now I need to loot. Alright, let's go. So I go back into the cabin. Pick up this rare rifle someplace. Take some moonshine. Take that, yeah. Hey, there's even some food over here. Can I eat that? Buddy, you got a rifle around here. Oh, shit. Where's it at? Where's it at? Because I got to get going. I ain't got time. Scarlet. Mm. 
honestly, that'd be a good stream watching you learn how to figure out trying to learn that game in story version. Buy it later. Gun is the only good if you can shoot it, yeah. Alright, the crime is not, uh, crime's over. Uh, Those look like O'Driscoll's, I don't know. I'll mess with them. Um, Alright. So. <clears throat> I'm way over there. There's still a bunch of bodies over here, so... Uh, I potentially could go and loot them if these people ever leave. I don't know what they're doing. My wanted level's down, so I can go and ride over here. I don't want to cause no trouble with no O'Driscoll's. They seem to be leaving. Or are they coming this way? I can't tell. Come on, this red don't frighten you. What are they doing? That's an interesting AI. That's some very interesting AI there. Yeah, <laughs> dead eye. Barbie <laughs> on the rest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm not wanted at Wallace Station anymore. No, I never was wanted at Wallace Station. It was Fort Wallace that I was wanted. So, mission progression time. Game progression time. So, here we go. Uh, that is in Cumberland Forest. I don't think. Can I fast travel there? Probably not. So I will travel to Valentine. That'll be my waypoint. And we're going to set up a camp. Let's go. Uh, I looked like a bug. Me who plays on PS. I like your funny words, Magic Man. <laughs> Uh, where did I say we were going? We're going to Valentine. Right. Valentine, Valentine. Let's go to Valentine. Let's go to Valentine. Let's go to Valentine. And go do some stuff. <clears throat> Yo, Bean, you're the man, dude. I can't believe you got me watching until 5 a.m., bruh. It was like 10 p.m. when I was going to load up a game and play myself. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you're having a good time. Sincerely, bro. <laughs> Sincerely, I am. Um, From here, we can go to Eagle Flies. 
Right. General store sounds good too. Let's go to a general store so I can get some canned goods. Some food, provisions, things of that nature. That there horse sure is a beauty, huh? Thank you. And thank you all for hanging around all night long. It's been a pleasure doing you ain't this. Been through in a while. Got everything you need. Have a look. As someone who exclusively yeah, plays the first you version like of Red Dead right 2, yeah. fast traveling from campfires is something you're not used to, but very jealous of. Town. How dare you provide entertaining content? Us gamers need to game too. <laughs> Bro, you sound just like me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You sound just like me. Bro, how dare you entertain me? Don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> oh, dude. Everything in that is available for purchase. Oh, don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> Let me put some more smiley faces on, on the, uh, the board there. Alright, we're buying everything. Sweet corn! I love the sweet corn. The sweet corn's awesome. Yep, we're just going on a shopping spree here, bro. In the store. We're gonna buy real corn. Yep. Peaches. Carrots. We've got all the money, man. We're buying okay, all man. of the food, man. All the food. Let's go. Prime beef, man. Yeah. Yeah, everything. Give me all the food, all the chocolate. All the coffee. Oh, we're going on a spending spree here. Um, let's see. Some pomade? Sure, why not? We're buying everything in the store. Pistol cartridges, revolver cartridges. Well, go back. Rifle cartridges. Holy goodness, I like shopping at this store, man. Herbivore bait. We're going to buy that stuff, too, even though we don't Last need it. Time. Predator bait? Yep. Fishing lures, just in case. I don't need a pocket watch. I always... I already have plenty of those. Okay. Dude. Um. Well, that's catching up. We'll go back to the board over here and highlight your name some more here. You have corned beef hash? Dude, corned beef hash in a can is pretty good. It's not like real corned beef hash, but it's still pretty good, dude. Being the main store in town, people come to depend on you. Uh-huh. Dude, appreciate you so much, MK. I'm doing this again tonight, so <laughs> just be forewarned. I'm going to be here again tonight. Um, I don't know what time yet, but uh, I will be here tonight. Let's look at pants. I want to see what kind of chaps they have, if any. I got all kinds of coots coming here. That's something. I don't guess I'm going to see any... Oh, wait. Shotgun chaps. Here we go. What do these look like? What do these look like? You know? You know? Seem a bit taken with that. I'm just a sexy boy. Sexy boy. I'm not you. Any wrestling fans out there? So. These are beautiful. But I'm going to keep looking. I need some chops. Fringed shops. What are the fringed shops look like? Ooh. Oh, no. Pretty fast. Now those are looking good. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. You know, those look good. Those look good. We're buying Enjoy. those. Yeah, we are. Uh, <laughs> all right. Um, whoa. I also need to look at more shops. Tanked half chaps. Ooh, what do those look like? Ooh. I mean, those are kind of cool. You like that? I do like that actually. I'm gonna hold off on that though. Rider spurs. Is that all the chaps they have here? Oh, uh -huh. fringe chaps. Boots, boots. If Mrs. B ever gets vacation time, you need to get her on your live stream more. I would love to. 
I would love to. Valentine's been a rough kind of town <clears throat> as long as I can remember. Did I buy anything? Got what I need. Yeah, look at me. Look at me. Yeah. Alright. New WWE game coming out for PS5. You just want the PS5. Me neither. Me neither. Horses off the march. Really? Just getting worse, that problem. Mind yourself, Alright, so let's keep on going. Look at them chaps, man. Those are nice looking. Anyway, yeah, I, I love Shawn Michaels growing up. He is an awesome wrestler. One of my favorite wrestlers to this day. And, uh, yeah, <laughs> the, the, the chaps just remind me of him. Like, my Intercontinental title belt that I bought, it's, uh, it's modeled after the Shawn Michaels belt that, uh, and the Razor Ramon one, too, the, the white strapped one. Um, even though you found your channel, you already want to, even though I've just found your channel, you're already one of my favorite YouTubers. Oh, thank you so much. That's so kind. Uh, MK loves their gaming. You're overpriced. Uh, I can't read. I love my overpriced put me in debt PC. I understand. <laughs> Entirely. <laughs> I certainly do, but aren't they amazing machines? I mean, aren't they just truly amazing machines? I bet she's up there. Hey, go around, climb up. Hey, climb up. Okay. Yeah, aren't PCs just amazing machines? Yeah, bro, I haven't played a game in days. I've been here watching and even became a member. And I am so very appreciative of your generosity, dude. Never expected, but certainly appreciated, yeah. man. Helps do things like this. You know, buy games and uh, keep this place running. Licenses for various softwares, you know. Adobe ain't cheap. That's uh, where all this money goes to. Like, I buy games, I buy Epidemic Sound, I buy Motion Array, and I buy Adobe. And I buy computer parts. <laughs> Your phone, yep. So good of you to join us. Yep. What's going on? I spend money on a phone. The smell of Cordite and integrity. Valve Here's index. A beautiful thing. What are y'all doing? An eye for an eye. We didn't start this, Arthur. They did. We? This ain't our fat. It surely is. Whatever it is you're planning, it ain't a good idea. They want you to fight. Nobody will be killed. We're just gonna trap a few of them in the valley, disarm them, tar and feather them, and remind them to leave these boys alone. You have energy for pranks? Come on, Arthur. Just tweaking Uncle Sam's nose a little. I need you to help me. Okay. Besides, it's perfect. People will see these boys. They won't notice us, and they'll think we're gone. Everyone will blame everything on the Indian problem, and we'll disappear up the river. But first, we need to trap them in this pass. Help me dynamite up these trees. So, you're using them? No, sir. No. Never. But, it is mutually beneficial to draw attention to one problem and avail over another. These are good people, but their situation is real complex. We ain't helping them. Sure That's 8500 in streaming. No, it ain't cheap. Sure. Ah, uh, then you gave up on it for now. Much respect. And much respect, dude. I guess I gotta pick this up. 
It's a lot of fun, but it can be a dress. <clears throat> In time. If I didn't have the amount of time that I have, this would be impossible. I really do. I got to thank my wife for that. She allows me to do this. I sent for some of that dynamite you and Bill commandeered in Van Horn. Good work with that, by the way. Bill played drunk. The perfect man for the job. Don't have the time, even though you're single. If I didn't have her, man, I wouldn't be able to do this. There's no way. So, you finally got to see Colm Hank. Yeah. After all those years, hard to believe. Go for it, man. Oh, but it was worth the wait. See? We're tying up the loose ends, Arthur. One by one. It's a lot of fun. Like, I never thought that I would enjoy the social aspect of it as much as I do. And, you know, the most fun thing that I've gotten out of this entire thing is I've gotten a love for Photoshop out of it. It's kind of weird. Like, I love doing Photoshop now. And that was one of the most intimidating things when I started doing this. Uh, mic check one two like when I first well I've been video editing for a long time for 20 something years <clears throat> nothing to this degree but I've been editing video for 20 something years and longer than that honestly because oh crap um um uh, I used to do the TV thing uh, back in high school and whatnot, but uh, yeah, I never got to learn photo editing and Photoshop specifically. It was always very intimidating, so I always had the the video side of it. I knew that I could do that, but I was so intimidating by having intimidated by having to learn Photoshop and make thumbnails and title and tag and blah 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 blah. And then I was like, man, one day there was some stuff going on. I just decided to make a video about how to stream without a thousand subscribers from your cell phone. And then a few months, weeks after that, then I just decided that I was going to start streaming every single Wednesday night Jackbox, and then just kind of kept there, going from there. <laughs> will let us know when they're near. Two and a half, three years later, whatever it is. Coming now. God damn. Patrol's a lot larger than we thought it was gonna be. <laughs> what are they Don't looking worry. at? That's a good thing. Where's my mask? Okay, that's the signal. Here Wait, they... put that back on. Come, stay low and quiet. You sure you don't want me to man that plunger, Arthur? No. Oh, there they are. Oh, remove the weight of the world from your shoulders for a minute. Six like hours I on said, a thumbnail. We're just going to yeah. give them a bit of a scare. Oh yeah, dude. There There's a s <clears throat> looks like more than we thought. It's fine. We're only here to talk and administer a little good old-fashioned humiliation. You're owed that, son, at the very least. Wait for my lead, men. Everyone, just stay calm. We've got the upper hand here. Okay, they've passed the first truck. <laughs> Your hands up! You surrounded! Nobody need get hurt! Your humiliation of us has gone on quite enough. This ain't a good idea! Put down your guns! You are making a mistake, boy! No! You're making a mistake! Put your hands up, soldier! Take a little humiliation and leave these fine folks alone. <laughs> Who are you? A concerned citizen. Is that so? What now? We should move. No, 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 not quite yet. Soldier, you and your friends gonna tuck tail and run off? Run! That's, Excuse me? That makes me feel okay, really good, dude. Is. Your friends fire first, soldier! Oh, God. My father will be happy about this. They fire first! Patrol in the rear! Look! We got a fight, man, boys! Don't get started! 
this. Watch your head. Look out. They're coming up. All right. This is bad. Just turn your hand for what you're taught. Time for revenge. Our people have suffered too long. Okay, friend. All right, more firefight. Let's go. and bullies watch your goddamn mouth all of you take what you can and then we move out Ooh, all right so we're taking we what we can now now all right let's let me follow dutch and follow dutch these men quickly then we move this is crazy why aren't we getting out of here they might have information on them that'll help our friends with their cause we need anything my father can use to strengthen our case i ain't sure much is gonna strengthen your case after this yo specs what's up dude how you doing man Good evening to you. Find anything? Yes. Some poor fool from New Jersey. These boys ain't the problem. They're only kids. Keep looking. <gasps> mm -mm. <clears throat> Shit! Everyone, keep your heads down. We're gonna get out of there. Where is he? This is a lot of men. There you are. Got you. No. Yes. All right. Where's Peta? Damn. They're sending riders from the. I know, right? But where's Peta? Was he killed? He's alive. <clears throat> well, that went just about according to plan. I'm trying. I'm trying, Arthur, with everything I have, and I will keep trying, and you'll keep doubting me, and we'll keep failing. It ain't like that, Dutch. Look at me. Look at me. I'm just. I'm worried about folk. I know. I... We should go. Where's Eagle Flash? Run, son! Run! Come on! This area is gonna be crawling with soldiers in a few minutes. We gotta leave. Now! Yeah. What about Eagle Flash? We gotta go, Arthur. Come on! Oh, you don't... Let's go! Oh, Scarlet. <clears throat> you and me, girl. But I need my hat. Thank you. Left here, into the trees. Yow. <laughs> okay, let's dismount here. We won't get the horses down this path. Is there anything in here that I need? Need to make sure there's nothing in here. All right, let's go. Oh, do I need to do that to my horse? 
Oh, um, horse. No. Scarlet. Go, what? Gosh, Scarlet, why are you out there in the open? Dutch. Dutch. What was that? Let's try this again. Let's see if we can lose him down here. Shit! I guess not. Get behind something, Arthur. All right, where are you, buddy? Get the other way, you freaking idiot. Buddy, hey, fool. What the heck was all of that? Holy crap. Dutch Gen got me killed twice. I'm gonna come down here. There they are. This is a losing battle, Arthur. Oh, we got get behind there. Oh, buddy. Get. All right. The cold. Mm -mm. I said put your damn hands up. Okay. Not good. Okay. Not good. Follow my lead. Great. I got a plan. Mm, of course you do, Dutch. This is a good one. Hello, officers. You keep them hands up and come here. Put your hands up. Hello, Captain. Keep your hands up and come here. Come here. We, uh, we can't do that. Your man. 
Those men they killed? They were good men. You're fighting nature, Captain. Get over here! Ask my friend here. My whole life, I tried to fight change. It's a waste. I see that. Now, it's a waste. You can't fight nature, Captain. You can't fight change. You can't fight gravity. Nice. Down the waterfall. Let's go. Nice. Killed all the men, still no winning. Wow. You're okay. Mm. Uh, what a mess. <laughs> I know. But a mess is what we need. Oh, we just escaped from chaos. Eagle flies must have been taken. Taken. Survival games. Killed. I've tried well, like Minecraft and Valheim. Oh, um, just, you know, they're Sharks. fun for a while. I get kind of bored with them. We'll honestly. This it? kind of game, though. I'll be back at camp. Let's split up. I'll go tell him. You rest up. Then go meet him up at the reservation. We are going to make it, brother. I can feel it. Faith, Arthur. Have faith. Dreaming of a buck again. Big boy, <laughs> come here, big boy. <laughs> Look at you, Dutch. Look at you, man. Okay, green hell. Game kind of based on a movie, great movie based on a true story. The movie is called The Jungle with Daniel Radcliffe. Oh. Add to the list, Green Hell. You mentioned that earlier, yeah. Sweet. Thank you. So we can look at the map, save our progress if it didn't already. Alright, progress saved. 61%. Ah! Crazy, right? What all do we have to do? Progression lines are... We go see Charles. What's up with Charles? Charles in charge of our days and of our nights. So, this guy... Oh, Charles, um, oh, we gotta do another detonation mission if we go and see Charles. So. Not another detonation, but another big, big mission. Uh, I'll have to make a new Discord to connect with people again. I had to disconnect for a while, probably while you're over social. <laughs> while you're over social now. I hear ya. Yeah, I'm not too big into Instagram or Facebook or anything like that. I, I like the Discord. I, you know, um, I'm not an overly social person like I used to be, but like even then, I'm, I can be alone in a group of people. It's one of those weird antisocial traits, but I mean, I like people. It's just that 
sometimes I feel lonely, even when I'm not. But <clears throat> the only thing we have left to do to progress the story is Charles. We've done a lot today. So, I've been streaming for almost eight hours. So, I'm going to call it a day right now. <coughs> Mic check, one, two. Call it a day. And uh, pick this up tonight. I'm going to get myself some dinner. Ugh. Yeah, get myself some dinner. Um... I'm going to check out these games that were suggested, uh, watch a couple of YouTube videos on those, and yeah, it's going to be great. I think right now I'm just going to rest by the campfire. Well, actually, what time is it? I don't even know. It's 6.37 in the morning. There's no need for all the resting. Let's tear down the camp, actually. Ooh, tear down the camp. Wrong button. I'll make it at least an eight-hour stream, just because. And, uh, you know, actually, I, I would love to get 400 playbacks. <laughs> I'm at 396 right now, thanks to all of you beautiful people. Hey, Bean, I'll see you tonight, man. Have a good one. Look forward to it. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna stream till like. Like, hopefully 400 playbacks, which will be a little bit over 8 hours if things continue to go that, the way that they're going. So, I really do appreciate y'all. But that's going to suck for anybody that just tunes in that wants to hang out for a while. So, it's probably the best thing that I just stream until, until I reach the 8 hour mark and then probably end it. That's probably going to be the best thing. But we'll see what the view count looks like. If anybody's tuning in, I really appreciate y'all coming in, stopping by, saying hello, smashing that like button. I do plan on streaming again this evening. I don't know what time it's going to be. I might actually get some decent sleep today. Like, there is a very real chance of me getting some decent sleep today. Which is awesome. Because, oh, horsey. I could, uh, I could definitely use some of them. I'm, haven't been getting too much uh, good sleep lately. There is no way you're making it down there, sweetheart. No way you're making it down there. Let's follow this little trail and see where it goes. A neat little trail here. There's an, oh, here we go, here we go. Nice little camping spot. Honestly, I would start a two-hour stream seven plus hours later on YouTube would send me so many new people. Honestly, I would start at a two-hour stream. Seven plus hours later, YouTube would send me so many new people was consistent with other long-term streamers I'd watch. Uh, good night, chat, says MK. We got like 20-something seconds left in this stream, so... We're going to go ahead and save our progress right here. Less than 20 seconds to go or so in the stream. I'm still going to say my good nights to everybody. And my thank yous again so much to anybody and everybody who supported the channel then, now, and also moving forward. Uh, super big shout out to MK, man. You are awesome. Uh, thanks for hanging out with me all night. It's been a blast. Um, Appreciate the new subscribers. Welcome to the channel, M Ambersa. Uh, see, um, I don't, I can't pronounce your name at the moment. I don't have the the translate. Uh, so yeah, man, thanks for the super chats and for joining the channel. You're absolutely amazing. Uh, being good, hanging out with you. Distressed, good, hanging out with you. I would love to list everybody. Fantastic wit. I do need to thank you because you are the moderator of all moderators. And it's awesome to see you around. Game Tamer, good seeing you, bro. Anybody out there lurking in the background wants a shout-out before I end the stream. Now is the time. Specs, good seeing you, bro. Eight-hour mark. Woohoo! <laughs> Distressed ROCC, bro. Thanks for hanging out. You guys are amazing. I'll see you all tonight, hopefully, around 8.30 or so Central Standard Time.
Not sure. We'll see how my day goes. But until then, be safe, stay positive, stay well, and have fun. Take care. Peace out.